Yay, <laughs> we're here there. Okay. <laughs> Man, I wanted this whole spiel. <laughs> you guys couldn't even hear me. That's so weird. It didn't say it was muted. Oh, what the heck? Okay, anyways. Um, <laughs> anyways, I have... <laughs> okay, I think you guys can hear me now. Okay. Yay, we're good. <laughs> Man, whenever I go in between like recording videos and streamings, I don't know, sometimes like the, the settings get all like weird. Anyways, what I was monologuing about before while I was muted was that I do have an edit. I uh, just didn't want to have it shown up on screen first because it's like kind of a spoiler. <laughs> I don't think it's like too much of a spoiler. I don't think people who like haven't beaten the game would know it but basically i've had this song stuck in my head like the whole week since we beat the game and uh, <laughs> yeah i'll just show it <laughs> i've had under the sea stuck in my head just thinking about freaking uh utsuro with all the bodies under the sea under the sea and then i couldn't help but make ayame kind of torn up <laughs> i was like i know it's kind of i know it's kind of dark <laughs> but I felt like I had to do it. I had to do it. It was right there because there's like all these little small fish there and I was like, it's just, if it's too well, if it's too well. Um, but yeah, so that's my, uh, it's my edit for this week. <laughs> I've literally had that song stuck in my head and I was like, it kind of works because Yuki's a ginger too and you know, he's got those little mermaid, <laughs> those little mermaid vibes. <laughs> I know, I did a yummy so dirty. <laughs> oh god. Oh gosh. Am I am I fucked up? Maybe a little bit. <laughs> Maybe a little bit. <laughs> Blurst. Oh gosh. Well today, um, I think we're going to be doing 6.5. Um, we do have some free time events too to finish up. There's also the if stories, which I don't know how long they are those are. Um I'd like to do all of it, but like I don't I don't think I can handle another eight hour stream, y'all. So we'll see. We'll see how much I uh, get through. <laughs> oh God, I can see the, <laughs> the chat responding to the meme. Isn't it cute, guys? Isn't it adorable? It's so kawaii. Oh my God, like little Mitch Sebastian. He's so cute. <laughs> yeah, I got the Kenji. He's already plotting his uh, second, second go around. Yeah, we'll probably do Mitch's free time events uh, this stream too. Okay, anyways, I will um, take this off and, oh yeah, I want to give, of course, a shout out to the subreddit. We have like um, a couple of, oh my god. <laughs> that was a lot. Okay, let's go to display two. There you go. I don't know why OBS is being so weird for me today. These are some of my favorite posts from the subreddit this week. Uh, our Weeby News, if you guys want to join, there's a bunch of fun memes on there. But yeah, this one was like a Teruya with all of his siblings. I mean, like, some of these edits are so good. Like, they did such a good job. <laughs> Making them to the different uh, Teletubby forms. I love it. I love it so much. Oh, thank you, Kidora. Finally caught up to enjoy a live stream. This series has been keeping me company while I've been sick with the flu. You're a delightful content creator. Oh, that's so sweet. Thank you. I appreciate that. I hope you feel better, too, from the flu. Um, that stinks that you had that, but hopefully you can uh, get uh, get better soon. And this one is by 5hox, or 5h0x, I think. And then this is another one I liked a lot. <laughs> and this one is by um, Bill Dorito. What if you wanted MLM and WLM solidarity, but God said, <laughs> they crazy. I think that's a plus for some people, but <laughs> not, not really for our other ships. Well, Ayame did say that she could fix her, and like... She did. It was a little too late, but like Akane was thinking about her at the end and like it was close. It was close. Kenjo didn't really do much to fix uh, Utsuro though, unfortunately. <laughs> there wasn't a, wasn't too much. Ah, uh, thank you, Seth. I hope you're doing well too. Yay. Thanks uh, for joining, Zephy. And also let me know if any of you guys are interested in um, becoming a mod because I think we're going to need more mods for um, whatchamacallit um, Super Dog Naropa and other two because that one's like really popular and I feel like people are a lot more spoiler happy with it. So I feel like there's a pretty good chance that we're going to need more mods. So um, if you're interested in becoming a mod and you know all the, um, whatchamacallit spoilers for that game, um, let me know and I can mod you because yeah, like I said, I think we're going to need a lot more people. <laughs> oh, cra oh, that was about to be really loud. That was about to be super loud, huh? There we go. <laughs> 
how hard you could be? Or, uh, PR Nilo. Okay, I will mod you. We might need some extra people to help out today, too, because, uh, okay. Yay, you should be modded. Sequel. I could definitely. Clover, I've seen you around a lot. So I will mod you as well. Nice. Poggers. Chapter 3, the chat will be spoiler hell. Oh gosh. I was like, I know, I was like, some of these, um, I might just like honestly, uh, need to, um, <laughs> like not look at the chat <laughs> at all. Because yeah, I remember Blaze said that spoilers are really bad. I think Blaze said that they had a really hard time with, uh, oh, Ellie, I'll mod you too. Okay, we have like three people, so that should help at least for now. <laughs> at least for now. Oh yeah, yet another Mitch Stan. I didn't know you'd uh, played uh, Dark Norpa 2. I will mod you as well. Okay, cool. So it's like four people. We should be good then. So uh, hopefully um, everything should be good. Oh my god, Bestie, can I be a mod? Oh my god, only if you start uh, standing uh, Monica mod key. <laughs> Otherwise, I'm sorry. I just can't have a Monica hater as a mod. It's just too much for me, okay? Just too much. Oh gosh. Okay, um, let's go ahead and start. <clears throat> and here we are, under the sea. <laughs> I can't help but think of that. Under the sea. Oh wait, is it? Audio is working, I think. Right? Let me double check. Um, why is... Oh, I don't understand why it is being so weird today. Wait. One second. I think the music's not working. <laughs> why, God? Why am I being tested today? Uh, I don't know about this. Okay, I think that worked. Let me know if that worked. <laughs> okay, uh, thank you guys. Sorry, I had um, some donations I missed. I will destroy Mitchified Yamato. As I said, I'll be willing to mod. Also, Danganronpa and other gay academy. <laughs> thank you. Um, I'll let you know. Oh, please mod me. I know what happens in Super Danganronpa and other too. Um, oh wow, so many, uh, so many people who are willing to be mods. Thanks, guys. Um, I already modded like four people, so uh, hopefully it should be good for now. Um, but I'll let you guys know if we, uh, well, I don't know, maybe it would be good just to go ahead and mod a couple of other people. <laughs> I'll mod you guys too. And, because I know YouTube has like a cap, I think, on how many moderators I can add. Okay, I'll mod you guys too, and then after that I think we should be good. I think we should be good. <laughs> Bikini bottom looking a little different. Okay, cool. I remember somebody last time was saying that like, if you talk to uh, Utsuro, I think you can like, uh, I don't know, play like, a game with him or something? <laughs> Let's play a game. Congratulations on clearing the game. Oh, you think you're so fucking cool for doing that, Weeby? Um, why am I here? It's pretty crazy I can breathe under underwater. <laughs> God, e-girl Mitch. <laughs> Mitch time! Maybe you'll become a tier 3 sub. Oh, thank you, Mitch. <laughs> e-girl Mitch. What does the text say, too? <laughs> we got e-girl streamer Mitch. We love to see it. We love to see it. <laughs> Thanks for the donation, Dar. I appreciate it. Oh, good, my donations are at least working. Even though the rest of my OBS is, like, not not working at all. Oh, gosh. Why am I here? Unintentionally taking on a role. Paying no mind. Why do I sound like Midori, Weeby? Because you're a little douchebag, just like him. Well, it is an odd role, but... Are you running out on medals or not? What do you mean? Simple. If you can compete with me for a certain amount of medals and win, you can get several times that amount. Don't make that face. I'm not doing this because I want to. Ah, thank you. <laughs> thank you, Mitchified Yamato. <laughs> Help me out as much as you can. Hopefully, hopefully we can fight the spoilers together. In Omake Mode, you can play Rock, Paper, Scissors with Utsuro. You can enter, you can earn five times the amount of medals. <laughs> like I'm ever gonna beat him, dude. He's like super hella lucky. If you win against Utsuro by betting on medals, However, if you lose, you will also pay the same amount of medals you bet against Utsuro. Also, don't think of this as ordinary rock, paper, scissors. Keep in mind his ability, consider carefully, and decide with caution. Will you win? <laughs> no. Okay. Oh, ask about your history play? Oh, is it like the epilogue thing? Okay, let's play rock, paper, scissors first. You may regret that choice. 
Now then, decide how many medals you wish to put on the game. <laughs> one. <laughs> okay, it's a one. If you win, you will get five medals. I ain't betting anything against you, bro. I know I'm not gonna win anything. Now then, are you ready? Rock, paper. Eh, eh. I don't know, dude. This feels like a Mori again. Rock. Oh, fucking chorus, dude. I feel like you just... Oh, thank you, Kev. Thanks for the donation. Also, I think Kev might be streaming, too, because I was watching a little bit beforehand. Hope you're doing well, uh, Kev. Uh, what was I gonna say? I feel like... I don't know. I feel like they're just gonna, like, rig it towards him. Like, <laughs> it's gonna know what I chose, and then he's just gonna be like, Oh, I automatically... I don't know how, but I just automatically knew exactly what was gonna counter that. I won. This was a natural result. Now I'll confiscate all of your medals. It was a win, so don't think ba badly of it. You lost one medal. At least I, uh... At least I don't lose too much. You will regret that choice. Okay. Um... <laughs> Big better over here. Okay. Let's see. Rock, paper. He won't choose paper. I feel like he's just gonna choose whatever. Oh, hey, we tied. Huh, I thought it was always just gonna be rigged. Hmm. Oh wait, it says 1% on the wiki. Is it like the win rate for us? <laughs> it's a draw. It's a great achievement to get a draw from me. So let me tell you to take it with pride. Since this is a draw, the medal exchange won't change. Oh, I got one medal. Okay, one more time, one more time. Go, be a risk taker, go for the twos. Uh, I guess so, let's do two mana coins. I don't think I even have that many mana coins to be totally honest. Okay, rock, paper, let's do paper. Ah, oh, fuck you, Zero, cheater. <laughs> Bet 20, take the risk. <laughs> I've won, this is a natural result. Oh God, I'm so fucking epic. Oh god, even Ghost Akane is still simping for me right next to me. Even though I'm addicted to her for some reason. Three coins. Oh, Midori plus Utsuro equals double douche. <laughs> that is too true. They do, well, I feel like Midori is more of like a little shit, you know? Utsuro is just kind of like, I don't care, you know, I'm just whatever. I'm just evil and like, I'm just so bored by how evil I am. Oh man, but I do feel like the voice. It's him. I love the Midori voice too. It's so fun to do. Scissors again. Ah, fuck you, Zero. Three coins. No. No. Not my three coins. Okay, let's talk to the ghost of Akane. Um, under the sea. Under the sea. I like that song. <laughs> ha. Enter chapter. Oh, hey, that's probably 6.5, right? Explanation. And this is where you can play Chapter IF via this room without attempting to replay Chapter 1. Oh, Chapter IF? Okay. This is merely for the build of this game only. There won't be any other who have this any others who have this feature. However, you can play Chapter 1 and enter through the original method that the original story was supposed to go. Once again, this is simply a shortcut. Uh, oh! Whoa, well, there's like some voice acting there. What's up, Akane? <laughs> Also, I suggest you don't try anything funny in the room. It's only for the usage of the item. I won't be held responsible by another's curiosity. You've been duly warned. All right, the credits for this translation goes to Alex Wolf and Zephyrum. Yay, claps for them. Thanks for playing. Okay, so that's IF. And what's, um, where's 6.5? Hello, hello, congratulations on clearing the game. I don't know what voice to give her now that she doesn't, she's like loud. You're surprised? I'm in charge of explaining the free time events with our friends again. Can I actually play them through this? That'd be pretty sweet. If you want to see a free time event that you've already seen already, be sure to visit this beautiful Makako. What? Who's the beautiful one? That's me, dude. I'm the one who's dating Kinjo. Oh, wait, it must be because Kinjo. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> He's actually bringing up Kinjo. <laughs> oh my god. It's just because Kinjo calls me that all the time on her dates. It's it's totally canon, Yuki. I'm sorry. You're kind of like evil and shit now, so he's like not really interested in you anymore. Uh, sorry, bro. Must be because Kinjo calls me all the time. <laughs> oh my god. Sorry, Miss Beautiful Makako. 
Free time event replay is available through Kurokawa and Omic mode. In this mode, you can see the events of the friends you've completed, the free time events, and the main story. Oh, this is just replay, so you can't see who you didn't finish the free time events. This isn't um, super applicable to me, applicable to me, since I always went to Tacoma. Okay, let's go back. I know that was that was so cute. I didn't, I didn't expect him to actually uh, bring up Kenjo. Oh, did you finish the game? Congratulations. You might be surprised to see I'm healthy here. I'm immortal, but right now I'm in charge of sending you to chapter zero, including chapter zero. You can also replay the past parts of chapter six. Okay, so this is chapter 6.5, I think. I just heterosexual besties. In the record books, it'll uh, go on to say that they were just besties. <laughs> if you want to see them, continue whenever you wish. Okay. Second chapter zero. Through Kisaragi, next to the second second round door, chapter zero and past recollec recollections can be replayed once more. Chapter zero can re be replayed at any time, but the recollections of the past must be unlocked through Monokuma medals. Oh, okay. I guess that's another reason why to keep, like, uh going through those. Okay, Teruya, why are you here? <laughs> I wanted to be under the sea too. Hey, big congrats. Uh, why am I here? Well, glad you asked. I'm selling a lot of stuff here. I gotta, I mean, capitalism's a bitch, Yuki. Come on, I gotta figure out how to sell shit anywhere. I am the ultimate merchant after all. I was like, hey, there's like three people living down here. Might as well profit, baby. Oh, chapter zero is the flashback. Kids fought back in the lab. Oh no, chapter zero is where the kids fought back in the lab with Mitch's redemption. Oh god, I don't know if I want to see. I don't know if I want to see Mitch's redemption again. I hate that. Like, I hate that. Like, I see comments defending Mitch now, and I'm like, damn, they're actually making some good points. Like, there was one comment on the last video was about how like uh, Mitch was like a douche, but he became like a better person through like hanging out with the rest of the students. Like during his time at Hope Speak Academy, and that's why like. He was nice in chapter zero, or like better, I guess, in chapter zero, maybe not. He wasn't like totally cleansed of his like douchiness, but you know, he was willing to like sacrifice himself and like protect others and stuff. And I was like, damn it, that does make sense. But like, I just love hating him so much. <laughs> I just love hating him so much, man. Uh, oh, well, we'll always have the memes. <laughs> Mitch Redemption. <laughs> I still hate you. I hate Mitch Key, though. That's still, that's still terrible. I am the ultimate merchant, after all. There are some items that are not easily available. But you can take a look at them here. Of course, the worth on metals is taken into consideration. Oh, that makes sense. You'd be like a shop. So take a look, Mida. Oh, magic ticket. <laughs> Korean. <laughs> Korean words down here. I don't know what that means. Oh, oh, hey, is this like, um, wait. Oh, okay, never mind. There's literally descriptions up here. I could just read this. I was like, I think it is probably, here's like the gifts, man's romance. <laughs> if you have, you will know the true man's romance. Oh, is that the um, gambling thing? Magic ticket, a ticket to return to Omake mode at any time. EMP shock device, thing that happens when you use it. A thing happens when you use it at a certain point. <laughs> Vague. Antique mug, antique teacup, looks historical. I guess these are all just things that uh, people like. Aw, uh, Kenjo probably loves that. Oh wait, no, it's probably Maki actually likes Thayer Gun. Or actually, didn't she, did she say she didn't like her talent? I can't remember. Dee Mitch Dimption, no. <laughs> Mitch Dimption, no. I know, I was like, I'm sure he did become a better person, but he still, he was still such a douche, dude. I don't know, man. It's like now I'm getting like more, I don't know, conflicted on him. And it's sex. <laughs> yes, gay Teletubby. Thank you, Lucky Star. <laughs> Appreciate the uh, donation. Always glad to have a gay Teletubby here. Yeah, it looks like you have like all these. I guess you can get the unique free time events if you want. I hope you use them again. I probably won't, bro. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. Oh. A stupid Ayame ability. I'm still, I'm like, uh, walking too fast. Oh, this object here is for the execution videos. That can be watched again. You can unlock an execution video for each person by using Monokuma medals. Once unlocked, you can enjoy them at any time. Oh, don't you want to rewatch, don't you want to rewatch Kenji getting executed or Satsuki? Oh my god, that'd be so fun. That'd be so fun, Yugi. Your favorite. Object, one that goes into the event theater and the in the event theater, you can view the CGs of the event scenes again. 
You can rewatch special event CG, the body discovery scenes, climax mystery. Oh, that's cool. You can also watch the staff roll again. However, please note that all CGs must be unlocked through medals and cannot be viewed until unlocked. Nope. Okay, I think we've almost clicked on everything. Just got a monocle at the bottom. Collection room. In the collection room, you can review collection items that you have obtained while freely acting with your friends. Also, if you have collected all the friends' selected items, you can get a medal reward in the collection room. Collect all of your friends' items. Um, I'm good. Okay, so I guess you can buy the stuff for that, too. Boo, 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 boo. You can play Chapter 6.5 with this Monokuma. Chapter 6.5 allows you to enjoy a brief sequel to the main story in an independent way. I'm like kind of wondering is this, if this is going to be like serious or uh, Mimi. I'm not totally, <laughs> totally sure which one. Uh, we'll see though, because I was like, what can they show after this? I was like, I don't know. I'm not totally sure uh, what would happen after the game, you know? I guess you could see what Kinjo's up to and like Rei and Teruya. However, you can play it after unlocking it with medals. And once unlocked, you can play it as many times as you wish. Oh shit. Do you wanna play 6.5? Yeah. Do I have enough medals? Okay, they got it. I was like, um, I don't know how many medals I have. <laughs> okay, that's good. I'm glad I had enough medals. Oh, it's like UGD or UDG. Oh, interesting. Hmm. Chapter 6.5 is a side story chapter with an independent system. Which system can be used to save, load, or return to the Omake Mo room at any time? However, when you return to the Omake room on the way, if you do not save, you will have to play it again for the beginning. Omake room. Don't skill anyone. <laughs> oh, God. Credits for this translation go to Moonlight and Zephyrom. If you manage to pull off a 10 death or less while recorded, Oh, if you manage to pull off a 10 death or less while recorded, I'll share the video on my YouTube. Oh, nice. Oh my God, I'm gonna go on YouTube. A few years ago, it was when my older sister came home for a holiday. Yuki's older sister? Oh, well, I'm leaving. Oh, good. Uh, what's with that reaction? You don't, you won't be able to see your sister for a few days. Is this, is this really Maki? <laughs> like, wait, am, am I Maki's brother, sister? How can you react like that? It would be much better if I had no sister. I'm going through my emo phase. I'm gonna go listen to Linkin Park in the corner. It's a bit sad that I have to leave when our parents are not here. <laughs> That's your fault, sister. You know it's our parents' wedding anniversary. How dare you talk to me like that? You're talking to your older sister, you know? I'm so confused. I'm like, is this Maki or <laughs> I feel like, I feel like, it, I mean, like, obviously it's Maki Sprite, duh. But it's like, keep being like, sister, sister, I'm not gonna say your name. Ow, that hurts. Remember to exercise every day. Goodbye. I'll be back next week. I guess I might be like, yeah, Maki's brother who's gonna have to fight Monokuma's or something, or sister, I don't know. It'll be better if you don't come back. Oh, come on. Don't be like that, Ryutaro. Okay. Anything else? Hey, thanks for the 10,000 yen for, from your wallet. <laughs> See ya. I stole it. I totally jacked that. Uh, uh, just die. Die, stupid sister. I guess it might be Maki's sister rather than brother since um, Kamari was... Um, Oh man, it really is Maki's sister, oh, or brother, or sibling. Monotube is amazing. Also, if you need any more mods, I can be one. I'll let you know. I think we're probably okay for right now, but um, I'm sure I'll have a better idea once we start the second game to kind of figure out uh, <laughs> if we uh, need more mods, though. But thank you. I appreciate the donation. That was the last conversation I had with my sister. Oh, hey. There I am. The fuck? Ah. Uh, oh, I am a dude. This place, I think. What was I doing? Why did I go into a place like this? Hmm. My head hurts. Let's take a look around. Is this... Chapter 6.5 mainly focuses on adventure. First of all, please search the objects around you. Press the X escape key to open up the menu. Pressing the key again will close the menu. Okay. Oh wow, it really is like an Elizabeth Spear Girls thing. Oh. 
Can I look at myself? Oh, hey, Ryutaro Maki. The younger brother of Kiyo Takamaki, the ultimate sniper who's super, he's super emo. He likes football and he's a fan of Kyoko's classmate. Oh my god, no! <laughs> no, he's a fucking Mitch stan! God damn it! I can never escape this douchebag. Oh my god. And he's a Mitch stan. Oh my god, that's just my freaking idol. I love Mitch so much. Just love him so much. God, you should totally date him. Totally date him, Maki. God, that's why I'm pissed off at you. He doesn't have a bad relationship with his older sister. I'm <laughs> so fucking dead, dude. Oh, God. Fucking Mitch Stan. <laughs> there are currently no colleagues you can talk to. Okay. <laughs> oh, God, I can never, I can never escape Mitch. Various types of firearms are scattered on the floor. I tried to pick one up, but it looks like they are models attached to the floor. Looking at them, it feels like someone close to me handed gu handled guns. I can't believe you the fucking Mitch, Dan. <laughs> A letter lies on the floor. Ah, oh, this letter. It's for Maki. Dear Ryotaro, <laughs> I am dead. And also your idol Mitch is dead. No, God, no, not Mitch. Oh, this letter. Dear Ryutaro Maki, family of Ultimate Sniper Kiyoka Maki, who is on the list of deceased of Class 79 of Hope Speak Academy. It's like, once he hears that, like, they're all dead, you know, before they actually die, he's like, his family's like, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, son, Maki's dead. He's like, yeah, whatever. They're like, and also Mitch, no, not Mitch, comes out with, like, a Mitch body pillow, <laughs> like a Mitch flag, Mitch t-shirt, like, just decked out of Mitch merch, merch. <laughs> no, not Mitch. I never got to profess my love to him. Damn it. Oh, God, who's Maki again? Perhaps a few years after hearing the news of your sister's death and years after the worst, most tragic event in human history, Mitch's death, you have given up all hope that your family member survived. But is that the truth? None of the bodies of the 16th students of the 79th class of Hope's Peak Academy were ever found. It's like, oh, my God, Mitch might still be alive. And we found out that they may be alive somewhere. The reason we investigate the 79th class is because we also have a deep relationship with them. Because of that, we cannot reveal our names, but we guarantee the credibility of this information. You can choose to believe this. However, if you really care about your family and are sincere, trust this letter and come to the place indicated. Okay. And please come alone. It's freaking sussy. This is... Okay. Yes, I remember the reason. The reason I'm in this place. Okay. He does look kind of emo, honestly. <laughs> what if Kyoka's brother is the true ultimate Mitch stand? That's his... Oh my god, that's his talent! Oh my god. My name is Ryotaro Maki. I am interested in football. And I'm a normal boy. And I fucking love Mitch. But due to the state of the country, I only try to survive as much as possible. The worst, most tragic event in human history. In this event, Hope's the Academy, the academy that represented the hope of the world, made the entire world fall into despair. In the process, almost all the students of Hope's Peak Academy ended up dead. Among them, my older sister, Kyoka Maki. <laughs> Maki? I literally called her Maki! <laughs> I'm so used to saying Maki! <laughs> oh god! <laughs> if Maki was, uh, was this guy's brother... <laughs> He might shoot him on sight for being a Mitch stan. <laughs> Kyoka Maki. 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 The ultimate sniper of Hope's Peak Academy. That is the cruel reality. Oh gosh. Without being sad to lose my family, I must continue and survive. This letter. It was sent to me. I read the letter and I went to a place mentioned in this letter. Alone without saying anything to my parents. Others would say it's crazy, but I wanted to believe in this letter, that my sister is alive. As soon as I got to the place in the letter, I lost consciousness and fell down. When I woke up, I was here. Okay, so we already like met them and stuff, and they just brought him. I mean, like, didn't the school collapse into the water? I mean, I guess this is like the ruins of it. Like how there's like a perfect little uh, path to like the bathroom. <laughs> oh man. Sorry, monkey. <laughs> oh, God. I probably fainted, and the letter slipped out of my pocket. Nobody would believe in a letter like this. Anyone would think that. 
Somehow I feel a longing in this ruined room, a strange feeling that you feel because your family. I was convinced it wasn't in complete, completely in vain. The hazy feeling in my head is gone, so let's get out of this place and look for clues. Okay, I think it would be better to keep the letter. Okay, can I go now? It's like, I don't know if I can press shift. Poor Maki, dude. It's a shabby bed. It's dusty, so I don't think I should lie down. But this bed, I feel like I'm missing something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love the song. There's something under the bed. A key? Oh, yeah, I remember. It was a fake school. I just meant the building in general, you know. Shower room key has been acquired. It's like Mizuno in there. I don't know where the shower is, but let's try it on that locked door. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, whoa. Holy crap. It's like a tunnel. This room looks like a shower. The wall has collapsed and it looks like there is a way through. I don't know where it leads, but I guess I have no choice. Huh. Interesting. Let me wash my hands first. Oh. It's like the little toilet for privacy, I guess. Okay, wow. So I guess, yeah, the... Looks like it just kind of collapsed. I was like, did Maki know about this, like, secret room? I was like, probably not. I doubt the pathway was there before. I guess, yeah, it's just from the room collapsing. I thought the ceiling would collapse. It's good to get out of here, but what caught my eye was another room that wasn't too different from the original one I was in. <laughs> oh, God, no, Dara. I get banned for shipping Ryotaro X Mitch. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Thanks for the donation. <laughs> oh, gosh. I think I can get out this way. Let's move in. Let's move on with determination. Okay. Oh, whoa. Oh, no. Oh, hey, Kenjo's room. Look, a little Kenjo's room. Why? I wonder why some of the heads are in front of the doors and others are, like, on top of it. It's like, is it blocked? Damn. Oh. Oh, that was, um, that was uh, our room, too. I didn't realize that. The robotic bear. Monokuma, it looks like him, fucker. Even at this point in time, people from all over the world are still slaughtered. A murder machine made only to spin despair, spread despair. It was launched during the biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history. My parents and I have encountered that robot many times and faced the danger of dying many times. We barely made it, came out alive. Is this place occupied by those guys too? Is it really more dangerous than I imagined? Even with a group of adults, it is almost impossible to neutralize one, and I am alone. Besides, I don't have any weapons, but I don't even know where this is, or where I can go. Like, hopefully, uh, hopefully it's not too clunky, the fighting stuff, or hopefully I'll be good at it. The situation is desperate. Most likely, I will die with a high probability if I continue to look for clues about my older sister. I might soon follow her footsteps. Still, I won't get hit. Do you think you will win? My family may be alive here. Until I know the truth, I can't die yet. I kind of feel bad that he, like, has hope and, like, already knows she's dead. Yeah, me and my sister and Mitch were always in good terms. My sister always treats me like a kid and gives me everything to eat. But I'm not here to pay back, pay back the money she borrowed. If I was the older brother, I would have done the same. But because she was a girl, I couldn't really interact with her properly. <laughs> okay. When I started thinking, thinking about it, it just boils down to it again. Also have a weird, I don't know, bias against girls. Just like my idol, Mitch. However, we're still a blood-related family. I wonder what he would think once he uh, finds out that Mitch was the person that killed his sister. Sometimes she's been really helpful and a good mental support. For me, that's what a sibling relationship is. Oh, is he 13? Oh, wow. He's so young. If my sister really is alive, I will search the whole place to find her and bring her back to our family. It's like, dang, is he really 13 and he's that tall? <laughs> dang, that's crazy. Even if it's a lie, there is no way they would, wouldn't would have anything to do with my sister's death as the 79th generation being mentioned. Anyways, it doesn't change that I have to pass that empty metal thing in front of me. Let's get straight up and act. Let's fuck up Monokuma. Looking at the icon on the top left, the Monokuma icon should be lit. This sign tells you the place where Ryutaro is currently in is in the action side. The action, action side is the part where you go while being unnoticed by Monokumas in that location. It's impossible to call up a menu and save in the action side, which means saving is not an option. 
Also, Ryutaro is an ordinary normal person with no strength at all. <laughs> he sucks! He will die if he enters in contact with a Monokuma even once. At the beginning here, there is no immediate game over and the game restarts over from a checkpoint. Okay, but that's only in the beginning? The goal of Chapter 6.5 is to escape from Monokumas, break through them, gather allies, and finally escape. Be careful not to die. I guess it's probably going to be other siblings from um, other people in um, the game that we're going to run into. I assume as much at least. I'm going to save just in case. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. <gasps> Who's that? Can I go in here? No. I'm so nervous. Oh, wait. Can I go in here? Okay, I just... I see, like, a Pokemon trainer. I just have to, like, avoid him. I am blind! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> I guess it's just kind of like that. Aw, Satsuki. Didn't Satsuki have, like, a bunch of siblings? Okay, okay, cool. Just gotta manage to not be seen by them. Do I get to shoot them at some point? I'd like to get my anger out on Monokuma. Okay, I gotta go this way, right? There we go. Okay, this one's a little funky. Oh. Okay, so... Oh, fuck me. <laughs> oh, god damn it. No. No, damn it. Uh, that one was kind of hard. A lot harder than the other ones. Okay, whatever. Okay. Oh, god. What the fuck? He got me already? God damn it. <laughs> god. Oh god, I have a feeling I'm gonna be bad at this. Okay, 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 okay. Get used to dying. Yeah. It's probably gonna happen a lot. <laughs> okay. Oh man, how many times am I gonna have to do all Oh my god! Are you kidding me? <laughs> how am I getting worse? How am I getting worse every time? Okay, 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 okay. As long as he's not on screen, it's okay. <laughs> Fuck, did that even happen? <laughs> Fuck you, Monokuma. I hate you, you piece of shit. Okay. <laughs> I can't believe I died that time, dude. Okay. Okay, I need to be down here. Okay, and blocks me after that. There's a skip portal. Oh wait, there's a skip portal if you die so many times. Oh really? <laughs> it's just like, it's like, wow, you suck. Here's a cheat. <laughs> okay. Okay, I need to get into like, I think that area, right? Okay, so, two, three, two, three, one. <laughs> Be overthinking this. So he just goes two ways, the other guy. Okay, okay. Once he looks up here again. Oh, god damn it. Okay, I think I need to get down to the freaking... I would love a teleport. I would love a teleport. <laughs> right about now. Oh my god, there he is. Okay, okay, okay. Man, I hate that one. <laughs> oh god. Okay, come on. Fuck you, Monokuma. Okay. Four. Oh, God. <laughs> Don't you hate it when you die so hard and you start 
start speaking Korean. This reminds me when I played and literally most of the time I got killed. And most of the time I got killed, I got scared by Monokuma. Monokuma jump scare is the scariest jump scare. I know. <laughs> it is kind of freaky for some reason. Um, okay. Look. Sometimes they look at the same time, right? And sometimes they don't. Because you just have to like... Oh, God. Oh, gosh, I'm getting nervous now. It gets way harder, really? Oh, God, I'm gonna suck at this. Oh, man. Okay. I think, um... Okay. Finally. Finally, God. I think I'm okay as long as I can't see him, right? Can I get the chest? Okay, come on. I want to get out of there as quick as possible, dude. Oh, God. Five nights at Hope's Peak. <gasps> oh, Jesus. It seems I seem to have overcome them somehow. Fortunately, this guy's intelligence is not that high. But the real issue is that I don't see any other ways to leave outside. I can't go back to where those guys are swarming. I have no choice but to go forward. Okay, I can save again. Swag. Oh, cool! I can actually see his face too, that's awesome. Oh, you should get all the chests because they're important to the story. Oh, okay, that one just gave me medals, but I wonder if the others might give me something. I was just scared too, cause like, it's freaking Monokuma, like, right there. <clears throat> it's like, man, is he gonna murder my ass? Oh, no. No, no more Monokumas. I don't want any more of this. Okay. I'm going down this way. Okay. Um. Oh, my God. What? Oh. oh, swag. <laughs> I beat him anyways. Oh, there's someone here. Oh, hey. They look like they might be related to Kakaru, I think. Hey, are you okay? Are you still alive? Hell yeah, you can outrun them? Sweet! Oh, the blue chests are... There's a special chest you can see. Blue chests are very unique ones. Okay, cool. Uh, welcome, uh, Zephyrum. I like your new uh, profile, by the way. I think that character's from, like, another Danganronpa fan gan, right? <laughs> I like uh, I like their design. It's pretty meme -y. Hey, are you okay? Are you alive? Maybe, like, uh, his sister or something? Hey, wake up already! Um. Ah. You're awake, thank God. Um, excuse me? Yeah, she does totally look like Kakaroo. Who are you? That's what I want to ask you more about. How did you fall in such a <clears throat> fall into such a dangerous place? Dangerous where? Ah, oh, that's right. I'm I'm looking for my brother. Aw. Ah, cough, cough. You okay? You were looking for your older brother? Can you tell me more details? Ah, yeah. Ah, yes, but what about you? Are you not a dangerous person? Ah, uh, sorry, don't be alarmed. My name is Ryotaro Maki. You said you were looking for your brother? I'm also looking for someone, too. I'm looking for my family. But when I came here, it was in ruins, and there's some murdering things walking around. Then you... I found you once I came here. You can... Can you understand the situation a little bit now? Oh, that's right. I've been alone all this time. My name is Midori. <laughs> oh, no. No. Curse name. There's like this random ass kid in Genshin named Midori, too. And I was like talking to her the other day and I was like, oh, no. The flashbacks, they're coming back. Oh, God. He has cursed that name so badly, dude. It's like, okay, I'm just going to leave you to rot now. <laughs> I don't trust anybody named Midori, man. <laughs> sorry, not sorry. Let me move my camera a little bit. There we go. Midori Yamaguchi. I won't do anything evil. Ooh, ooh. Just like you, I headed to some place. She's the mastermind. I already calling it the mastermind of 6.5. Don't trust nobody named Midori. In order to find my brother, but when I woke up, I was in a place like this. Is that almost the same situation as mine? Wait, something's wrong. 
Can you give me more details? I don't know if what I think is correct now. Okay, my brother. Ah, ah, ah. Cough. Man, I hope she's okay. Seems like kind of sick. Hey. Oh, man. Oh, no. Oh, Jesus. I was like, is she going to die on me? Hey, wake up. Damn, I thought I could find some clues. Did she get hit by an enemy? No, it doesn't seem like that. It seems like she's ill. Yeah, I guess it's probably pretty easy to get sick when, you know, the whole world's invaded by Monokumas and shit. Well, first, I have to do something about this kid. I can't leave her here. I'm going to carry her in a place where Ryotaro is trapped. There is several people who are in similar situations as Ryotaro. Every time you meet them, a special event like this occurs. And after that event, you'll be able to accompany that person. Okay, every time you meet them, a special event like this occurs. After that, you'll be able to accompany that, accompany that person. Right now, your priority is to heal Midori. Yes, heal me. I won't do anything bad to you. Ryotaro's movement speed is slowed down for a while because they're carrying Midori. Wouldn't there be a place to let Midori rest somewhere? Oh, is it like the beds, basically? Now I have to go through more Monokumas. I don't want to. <laughs> I don't want to go talk or have to go past more Monokumas, man. Don't make me do it, Midori. You are Midori. Damn you. Poo, 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 poo. Do, 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 do. Midori is all right now. <laughs> oh, that's what her, her big bro would say. So you got cancer. You're all right. Oh, gosh. Oh my god. <sighs> I was so freaked out because Monokuma looked at me down there. I was like, oh, thank god there's a pit of death in between us. Thank god. Oh yeah, the infirmary. That makes sense. Okay. Is he going faster than me? I was like, I wonder if... Um... Oh, she has asthma? Oh, that makes sense. It's like, he never actually turns. What if he's going faster than me though? Do 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 Oh, the fuck? Okay, cool. I was like, oh my god, no. I was like, please tell me no Monokuma saw me. Infirmary. If it's the infirmary, that means we're in a school. <laughs> About that, not not so much. Oh yeah, thanks for letting me know, uh, Lucky Star. By the way, sorry I kind of got distracted by uh, <laughs> you know Monokuma's and shit. But thanks for the donation. I appreciate it. Well, it's like the classroom where I met this girl a while ago. Before it was destroyed, this might have been a school somewhere, surprisingly. Anyways, it's an infirmary, so medicine would be helpful. Oh, is it locked? Ah, oh, god dang it. I thought this was going to happen, but the door to the infirmary was locked. Once I tried to enter- Who is locking all these doors? Monokuma just came back. I'm just gonna fuck with these guys. <laughs> I guess uh, somebody did try to lure him in the first place. I guess it's that person that, uh, you know, um, whatchamacallit. Um, lock the doors. Damn it, I don't know what, what, in what condition this girl is. I'd rather have her rest in the infirmary. Of course, there could be the worst case going into the infirmary and be full of Monokumas, but right now, I can't afford to assume such circumstances. Even in the rooms full of guns earlier, there were keys lying around. There might be a key to open this door to the infirmary somewhere. Yeah. Let's find it! Yay! More Monokumas! My favorite! Oh god. Oh Jesus. Oh fuck. Okay. Okay. Oh hey, there's a blue chest. That's probably the key, right? Ah, oh, thank you, Lucky Star. Anytime, Smiley. Thanks for the donation. I appreciate it. Okay. Leave me alone, Monokuma. Leave me alone. Oh fuck. Can I at least go back to... Can I please not... Do the whole thing again. Okay, at least I don't have to go through the cutscene again, right? I realized it once I got there. I was like, I think I screwed myself. <laughs> Pretty sure I screwed myself. I'm so slow. Okay, um. If you mitchify him, <laughs> mitchify him. <laughs> okay, um, what do I do? Just like waiting to, uh... Okay. 
Okay, I wonder if I can just like walk behind him until, um, there we go. Note one. Okay. I'm cutting my stomach. Oh my god, I'm cutting my stomach today. The drug has been administered. Painkillers were administered. I hate it. I hate this. I don't like it. It hurts. The f <laughs> What? I don't like being sick. Why did I have to drag? Why did I have to drag this? Did I do something wrong? No, 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 no. It's giving me Akane Tyra <laughs> flashbacks. <laughs> Yay, that was fun. <laughs> what a happy note. Okay. Okay. Try to figure out how to do this again. Why are you gonna go so quick, Monokuma? Oh god damn it. Why why did I do that? Whatever. <laughs> why did I do that? Why? Why? Uh when I get nervous too, I like Ugh. I'm so bad though at games anyways. But I get nervous on stream. I like playing visual novels. Maki brother, please drop Midori. You can stop the daddy smurf, Mitch. What? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Thank you for the donation, Dara. Oh gosh. I think, um... Uh, I don't know what to do. Try and find my zen. <laughs> Because the more anxious I get, the worse I'm gonna worse I'm gonna do. Okay. <laughs> Thanks for the donation, uh, Dara. If I didn't say it already. Okay. Um. Oh my God. Ah, uh, why? Why am I so bad at things? Ah, man. I'm sorry, guys. I don't know if there's an easier way to get around this without getting there in the first place. Let's see. Could you guys please not count the deaths? It just makes me more nervous. <laughs> uh, man. I can kind of tell um, um was last time I was able to kind of like do it once I got behind them, I was able to get up to like the chest part. That was like Oh god. Okay. So, I'm gonna try to chill here for a little bit. Um. Oh, thank you, Takayume. I love your videos, Weeby. I have a boring office job and your streams keep me company. Oh, that's so sweet. I appreciate it. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. I'm trying to think of... When he's down. Okay, when he... Okay, I'm like, let me get my mouse and do this. Can you guys even see my mouse? Okay, when he goes there. Okay, maybe it's best to do it when he's down there then. Because then I won't have to deal with this guy at all, right? Like, right when he goes down. Oh my god! <sighs> Damn it. Okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. <laughs> uh, I don't know what to do. I guess I was just too slow. It's kind of hard, cause yeah, I have this girl just slowing me down. Do -nee 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 -nee. <laughs> uh, it's videos like this, I wish I could edit. Eh, okay. I feel like it was so fast. Okay. At least I get through that part pretty- Ooh! <gasps> Way to go around, Monokuma. 
Thank God Lanouge made those portals, otherwise I'd legit quit the game. I was like, when do the portals show up? I was like, I was like, I would like some of those portals right now. Okay. I think I have to get like, I think I have to get down here and then wait until, oh God, that's so hard, dude. <laughs> I think I have to get down here and then move before Monokuma. Oh man, okay. I think, yeah, well, I thought so, but okay, let me try to get down here. <laughs> I'm so nervous. Wait, 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 wait. Oh wait, maybe I should wait till right when he goes away from that, right? Okay. Oh. oh my god, no, 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 no. He doesn't see me, he doesn't see me, we're good, we're good. <laughs> He's fucking freaking out in the corner there. Oh my god! <laughs> wait. Oh, damn it, he found me! <laughs> damn you, fucking Monokuma! <laughs> no! There's more I have to do after that one! <laughs> no. Oh my god. I would like a portal. <laughs> I would like a portal. <laughs> oh god. Although I gotta say, Monokuma freaking out in the corner was pretty funny. <laughs> oh, thank you, Jesus Christ! I love you so much! Yes, yes, I... Just do... Whatever. <laughs> whatever you're saying. <laughs> whatever you're saying, I want it. Okay, do I go down? Probably go down, right? Oh, gosh. Okay. Eh, come on. Come on. I don't know, I can't tell if I'm supposed to go. No, I think maybe the up place. I'll just go down first. <laughs> Bro, I'm so slow. I'm so slow. I hate this. Not gonna lie, I skipped 6.5. It was too hard to just watch videos of it. Rip. <laughs> Rip. I just literally thought it was gonna be like free time of like kind of free time of it type stuff, to be honest. Oh, thank god I'm blind when the plant's in front of me. Okay. Bro, how am I even supposed to do this? He's so fast! <laughs> I went too early! It's okay, it's fine. Okay, okay. I think I know what I'm supposed to do, I just have to actually do it. Okay, come on, come on. Oh! There we go. And then I guess I get behind him again? Where am I even going? Why am I even here? Just to suffer. I like that these Monokumas are blind though, I'm not gonna lie. I feel like I've gotten in front of them a couple times. They don't really seem like they care. They're just like, yeah, whatever, I'm just chilling. Just chilling. Chill my boy Ryuta. Ryuta, Ryutai, whatever his name is. What's up, Monokuma? Ooh. Mm, this guy seems pretty easy, at least. Just wait for him to go down. How do I walk? I don't remember. God, I'm so fucking slow. <laughs> a locker, please. Let's, let's stuff Midori in here. I don't trust her anyways. Just stuff her in the locker, you know, and like call it a day. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. It's fine. Just because she's named Midori, I won't, I won't hate on her. But uh, she she do be slowing me down a lot. Oh, there's something. All right, you got. Oh, thank God, the infirmary key. It says infirmary room. I'm lucky in this current situation, but this seems too convenient of a spot. Well, let's consider it to be a good thing, though. Only when this girl wakes up will I be able to understand the situation. More than anything else, my arms are starting to ache too. She's very light, but it's a human body still. Come on, let's go to the infirmary! Oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Oh yeah, I did hear that <clears throat> the second game was like partially dubbed, but um, I wasn't sure, yeah, if I should do the dub just because um, I wasn't sure how easy it would be to... Uh... Oh wait, how, how the fuck do I get rid of that Monokuma? 
He's blocking the way. Oh, poggers. <laughs> okay, cool. I'm glad. That made it easy. I was kind of like, would it be, I was literally thinking that I was like, would it just be easier if one of the Monokumas killed me? Do, 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 do I go back? Do, 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 do. Oh, I can't go that way. Damn it. Oh, whatever. Can I go back to the beginning if you do that? <laughs> oh, hell yeah. Do you need... <laughs> I kind of want to get to do that. <laughs> it's not complete to recommend the Japanese version. Cause yeah, I was like, um, I just don't know, cause it'd be cool to check out the dub, but I just don't want to have to replay through the first two chapters to like get back to where I was, um, you know, at before. That's my only like concern. Cause if it was easier to like transfer over my save file for the dub, then I'd totally be down to do it. But um, yeah, otherwise I feel like I'll probably just play the Japanese version. Is there actually like voice acting in the Japanese version though too? Now that I think about it. Thank God this place is better than anything else right now. Yay. Oh, gosh. I'm so glad to put her down, dude. <laughs> um, yeah, I wasn't sure if I had to replay it or not. Are you okay? Can you stand up? Oh, how did I come here? You were lying on the floor in the classroom, and when I thought you finally came to your senses, you immediately passed out again. Is that right? Oh, there is Japanese voice acting? Oh, that's so cool. Oh, guess what? All the free time events in the sub and dub are in English. Oh, cool. Don't worry, Weeby can transfer your save from the dub to the Japanese version. Okay, dope. That's awesome if uh, it is pretty easy to do. I'll um, probably talk more with like my mods and stuff. But uh, yeah, thanks guys. Ah, and you saved me. Saved? Saved? I I didn't do such a thing. I, I, Baka, if we get out of this hell, that's how we will truly be saved. I couldn't leave you all on your own, so somehow... So I somehow took you and moved you to this infirmary. I struggled a bit to find the key to it, but I think this is relatively safe. <laughs> sorry for the burp. <laughs> I caused such a nuisance. I caused such a nuisance. I'm so sorry. <laughs> you sure did. <laughs> Do you know how many times Weeby died? You seemed, you seemed to have a little fever, so I tried a first aid based on my medical knowledge. How are you feeling? Oh, yeah. Thanks. Hey, you are Mr. Ryotaro, right? I am Ryotaro Maki. Thank you so much, you saved my life. I'll reward you with anything in return. That's a huge thing to save for a reward, but I do have something I wanted to ask, is it fine? Oh yeah, anything, if I know it. When we first met, didn't you say you were looking for your brother? How did you end up in such a weird place while searching for your brother? Well, actually my brother went missing for quite some time now. Officially, he's been recorded as completely dead. But not long ago, a letter from an unknown sender was delivered to me. Yeah, I kind of figured she got the same. Same letter. The letter said that my brother may be alive, so I went to this place. What? No way! Eek, eek, what's wrong? I keep getting confused because I keep seeing Yamaguchi and just thinking of, like, Kakaru. And I keep seeing Maki and just thinking of, like, uh, Ky Kyoka. <laughs> so I keep, like, getting the genders confused. That letter you received, maybe. Sundere Ryotaro. I know, he do be pretty soon. Sundere. <laughs> Thanks for the donation, by the way, Lucky Star. Yeah, I was wondering what this is, too. I saw, I saw you point that out, Spanish Fly. It's like, what is this? Some weird, creepy poster of, like, a kid vomiting? It's like, nice. That's comforting. Wasn't it a letter that looked like this? Ah, this must be my letter. Oh, it isn't. It says, Dear Ryotaro Maki. Hey, you... Oh, your name was Miss Yamaguchi. It's like, who did this? Junko? It's always Junko. <laughs> of course, it has to be Junko. I'm Midori Yamaguchi. Just call me Midori. I'd rather not. Yeah, Midori, you were talking about your brother. Was he a Hope Speak Academy student? Yeah, that's right. How did you know? I said earlier I was looking for someone, right? My sister, who I'm looking for, is also a student at Hope Speak Academy. Then perhaps they died when the most desperate event in human history happened. Right, my family was also notified about that. My only sister, who I knew was dead for so many years, I found out that she may actually be alive. All because of the suspicious letter. 
Rhea Tara and I are both family members of Hope Speak. Rhea, Rhea Tara and I both have family members of Hope Speak Academy students. A letter like this was sent to those relatives? It's pretty sketchy to be just a coincidence, right? Then this strange place where my brother was supposed to be. Does it have something to do with Rhea Tara's older sister? I guess, so when you look at that place, when you look at places like the infirmary or classrooms, this looks like a school. There's also pictures of all of our uh, siblings on the uh, bedroom doors. I wonder what that means. Maybe this is Hope Speak Academy. Whoa, no way! Hope Speak Academy right here? Or a building that was disguised to look at Hope Speak Academy. I've never been there, so I can't say for certain. Dun, dun, dun. Maybe that's it, Mr. Ryotaro? If someone summoned family members of Hope Speak Academy students for some reason, wouldn't there be other people besides us? Yeah, I thought about that now. If they haven't died because of the killing robots running around like this. Mr. Ryotaro, I'm anxious to get out of this scary place, but going back without a clue about my brother like this, I don't want to go. If this is how it is, I have no excuse for getting out without my parents' knowledge. I feel the same. If that's stupid... <laughs> Come on, dude, don't call her stupid. I know you're a Sundere, but still, she died an awful, terrible death. If that stupid sister is alive somewhere here, I will surely find her and bring her back. Ah, oh, Mr. Ryotaro, since you already saved my life, would you like to go with me and find other people? I'm sure I might cause trouble again, but... <laughs> as long as I don't have to carry you anymore. But I think the purpose is that the same person who wrote the letter wouldn't have called our families to the same place for no reason. But of course, if you don't like it, you can reject me. I'm fine by myself. If you go alone, then fall down again. If you want to serve yourself as food for those killing machines, you want to serve yourself. Oh wait, uh, crap. Yeah, this is talking. Him talking. Let me get some water. I'd rather ask you to stay at my side because if I let you leave alone, you'll die in like <laughs> ten minutes. <laughs> I can't deny that. I'm pretty useless. It's better for me to be together than to be alone. If that's the case, let's take a break here and move on to the next floor. Oh no, do I gotta do, do I gotta do all the floors with this? Yeah, Mr. Riotaro. You said to, you said to call you Midori, right? It's kind of inconvenient for me to give names to people while I was told to call them. So you can just call me Riotaro. Oh no, I think you're older than me. That's kind of weird to call him Mr. <laughs> Mr. Riotaro if he really is like 13. It might be a little creepy. It might be a little creepy, but in a situation like this, unity with each other has a higher survival rate, right? To unite, we must first get rid of the awkwardness. Um, well, then I call you Riotaro bro. <laughs> bro. Um, uh, I really hate that title, but it's better than an honorific title. Do what you want. Okay, Riotaro bro, big brother, and um, huh? Thank you, thank you very much. If you ever need my help, you can call me. Uh, oh, God. <laughs> oh, she is his sister. <laughs> um, lawyer mode or lawyer mode. <laughs> it, Midori, are you angry? Uh, that's just my smile. Isn't it precious? Yeah. Oh, not at all. Don't ever think that I did something strange. I didn't do anything like put my hands on your chest and didn't do anything while you... Oh, Jesus Christ. Is that what you're worried about, bro? <laughs> <laughs> That's why you're worried that she made that face? Oh no. Of course, physical contact is unavoidable while being carried, but don't be angry because I didn't do anything except minimal contact. I've oh, got the face. I'm not mad at all. Ryotaro, bro. Why are you suddenly saying all this? You're so upset that expression is the expression that comes out when you're angry. My expression? Uh, Tee hee, but that's just my face. Oh no, this is just me. I was trying to laugh naturally. I like how they're they're also sweet, but they just have like angry looking faces. I love that trope, honestly. You used to laugh naturally before, didn't you? Ah, oh, that's because I was so nervous before. I'm the same way as my older brother. Maybe it's hereditary. If I try to pay attention to my expression even a little bit, I'll end up making an ugly face. Aw. Is that so? Then stay as nervous as possible all day. <laughs> Oh, you're very blunt, Riotaro bro. Oh gosh. That was cute. Look at the icon. The upper right, Midori's face came into shape. 
The icon in the upper right corner shows the list of companions you can meet in 6.5 and their faces are displayed when joining is successful as it is now. In other words, you'll be able to meet three more colleagues in the future. Gathering all your colleagues, gather all your colleagues and escape from here. Oh, and escaping from here is the objective for clearing chapter 6.5. Also, the conversation function in the menu was activated as a colleague joins. If you press the blue talk option, you can chat with your friend that currently joined. Okay, cool. Dialogue doesn't affect the story, but think of it as a way to get to know the characters. It is similar to the principle of free time events. In normal times, a certain conversation pattern repeats depending on the progress of the story. And as the story progresses, the conversation pattern gradually diversifies, so please feel... So please feel the small pleasure of getting to know the others. Okay, so as it progresses, you get to learn more about them. Midori has joined the party. Yay, I think. <laughs> Hopefully she's not like the other Midori. The younger sister of the ultimate lawyer, Kakuri Yamaguchi. Her body is weak, so she consumes medicine on a regular basis, and she spends most of her time in a hospital. Oh, poor thing. She likes her brother who takes care of her with his utmost sincerity. Okay, let's talk. Are you tired, bro? I'm so sorry because of my condition. It's okay. Still, it sure looks bad. Are you suffering from some disease? Disease? I guess, because it's not just one or two symptoms. Since I was born with a very weak body, I've been in the hospital almost every year. I see. Thanks to me, I only cause inconvenience to my family every time. Kenji's sister win. Oh, I do. I hope we get to see uh, one of Kenji's siblings. That'd be awesome. I'm especially sorry for my brother. I feel like I'm only making his heart suffer because of me. Isn't it normal for siblings to fight each other? My sister and I used to fight every day. God, I freaking hated her guts. Midori's brother seems to be a really nice person. Oh, I have a photo of him in my wallet. You want to see it? Oh, yay. It's going to be cute. Huh? Midori's brother? Let's see. I don't get to see it. I'm asking just in case, but was he bullied? Come on, don't ask that. He's a timid, termid herbivore. That's frustrating to me as a younger sister. Hereditary is scary. <laughs> Cute. Okay, let's save again, because... Oh, wait. No, crap. I didn't save. Okay. Save over six. I don't want to do any more Monokumas. I just want the portals. So we have no choice but to go to the second floor, right? There might be something else there. I crossed over from the other side, but I couldn't find anything special. Besides, this hallway and everywhere has been destroyed, so the places we can go are limited. That's true. If Mr. Yatara couldn't find anything else other than me, if there was someone else, there is a good chance they went upstairs. Let's be careful not to get caught by these Monokumas. Follow me closely, because I'm so good at this. I've only died like 10 times so far. <laughs> If you have a hard time, you can ask me to pick you up again, though I can't lift you for long. <laughs> I can run on my own feet! Sorry, I was joking. Don't be mad. I'm not mad. I I'm happy. That's me. Oh, gosh. Okay. So, I can't... There's no, like, map, right? Unfortunately. Oh, shit. Whoa, it's, like, going so fast now. I'm so used to being slow. <laughs> I just ran into him. Oh, did you try playing Rock, Paper, Scissors with Utsuro yet? Yeah, I did. I did. It was fun. I did at the beginning of the stream. Yeah, it's like totally different now being fast. Okay, I think I probably go um up that way. Man, I wish I could get the portal again. I don't want to have to do this again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you beat Utsuro two times in a row? That's crazy. Okay. I remember how I did this one, dude. I think, um... Oh, yeah, I waited for him to cross. That was what it was. There we go. It's like, does he ever look at me? Okay, he doesn't look at me here. Okay. Yay! <laughs> oh. Okay. This, it's right next to the stairs. We can't cross over like this. 
It seems like it was a normal passage, but there's a hole in this way, so let's see if we can go around. Yeah. Ah, cough, cough. Poor girl, dude. Majori, are you, are you okay? That's okay, I'm fine. This is my daily living. Ew, your feet have gotten swollen. Oh no, oh no. There's no need to force yourself like this. I'll carry you. No, no more. But if I talk it, but if I talk about how difficult things are, your life will be blown away. I like to take a rest when I can too. Since there are no Bonakumas right now, let's turn around. I'm sorry, it's because of me. You're apologizing too much. I'm fine, so think of your health first. How can Ryotaro, bro, be so kind? You met someone for the first time today, and then saved my life. It's not that I'm nice, but I'm just kind to all women. That's my motto, except my stupid sister, who I hate. I know, I was like, man, I gotta carry her again, probably. The exception to this is my own sister. <laughs> ah, that's something people call a playboy, are you? <laughs> you idiots, it's not the same. This is just something I wanted to copy. <laughs> The bitch standing's back, no! <laughs> From a soccer player that I worship with my life, I studied his ways of douchebaggery my whole entire life. <laughs> hey baby, you wanna, you wanna hang out in my room? What did you do to Connie? <laughs> you wanna hang out with me, baby? <laughs> that's, that's him uh, trying to copy the Mitch way. What's Mitch do with that freaking, uh, freaking eye? He's like that. <laughs> that's our boy. Something I wanted to copy from a soccer player that I admire. Now that the story has come out that soccer player is also my sister's classmate. In other words, he was a student of Hosei Academy, the ultimate soccer player. Ryotaro, bro, you're really talkative, aren't you? I don't want to hear about Mitch, come on. Keep quiet, even if I didn't say, you were originally asking anyways. My older sister is a person who entered Hosei Academy with the talent of the ultimate sniper. I heard a little bit about her school life when she came home. <laughs> um, Midori's brother, he is Kakari Yamaguchi, the ultimate lawyer, right? That's right, I'm Kakari's sister. But how did you... When I heard your last name, Yamaguchi, I remembered it. He's like a Hope's Peak fanboy. But there were things that my sister mentioned while skipping over. There were some related topics. Topics? Are you not familiar with the internet? Well, such a thing exists. I love how, yeah, Mitch is still getting brought up so much during this, uh, <laughs> during this event. Weeby, do you want to know about the egg cult? Sure, what's the, uh, egg cult? I'm sure it's better than the Mitch cult. <laughs> That's all I know. Thanks for the donation, by the way. <laughs> my older sister and Midoriya's older brother are super famous. I spend most of my, most of my time in my, ah! Oh my god, I can't speak today. Um, I spend most of my time in a hospital, so I'm in the dark about the world, and I don't know much about my brother or his friends. I've only met some people in person, especially since Kanata comes to the hospital regularly to watch over my condition. The ultimate surgeon? Oh! Oh, that's so sweet! Oh, they were besties. I know her. She seemed to be nice with my sister. Aw. Other than that, only a few people my brother told me about. Okay, cool. I was... Yeah, it's like it makes sense that they wouldn't have lost any of their memories. They just weren't really talking about, you know, the other classmates too much until now. That's so cool though, they actually got to meet like Kanata. Of course! Of course Honoria would be friends with everybody. Because she's the sweetest! I have real I realized it now, but Midori's family is really from Hosepi Academy students. You thought it was a lie? No, that's not what I meant! It's because this is the first time I've ever met the family of an ultimate student other than myself. My sister is just annoying me all the time. Dude, he's such a tsundere. Because she was a super celebrity in the world, I felt a sense of disparity. Oh, no wonder he was emo. I guess that makes sense. In the shadow of his sister. Somehow I think I understand. I heard that my brother had been scouted at Hope's Peak. I couldn't believe it either. That timid and teased older brother is from that academy. Those kinds of people may be living here now, but we don't know yet. Yeah. I wish they were alive, everyone. My older sister and Midori's older brother. I got some bad news for you guys. <laughs> some really bad news. Other people too. Uh, do you want to move slowly? We can't be resting this much in this kind of place. Yeah, I'm fine now. <laughs> Thank you for your concern, Ryotaro bro. 
Don't make that face when you say that. You take care of your face. Oh god, she's so cute. Uh, oh well, here we go. More, more Monokumes. I don't even remember really coming in here. I guess it was the gym. I think we just like didn't really come in here too much. Oh, well, we didn't have to carry her. That's nice, at least. Okay, so he just goes up and down. Um, probably best to go down here, right? Or maybe. Am I gonna be able to, or? It's just like these two Monokumas, whenever they go. I don't know if I could save, actually, could I? Was I able to save there? Cause uh, the Monokuma thing came back like right afterwards. Is a cult owned by Nike, we worship eggs. Want to join? Oh, like worship eggs? Sure, why not? <laughs> I'm down. Why the frig not? <laughs> Thanks for the donation, by the way. This very generous donation. Um, I'm trying to make sure that I'm not going to get killed by this Monokuma. I think I'll probably be okay, right? Oh. Okay, cool. Whew. Oh, man. Let's get my journaling going. Um... Okay, I can walk on the treadmill. I didn't think I'd be able to walk on the treadmill. Whew, that's good. Ten medals! Yay! Whew, okay. Oh my god, this game's so stressful. <laughs> uh. Okay, I guess I exit through there. I wonder if there's anything else, though. Why he's so fast, bro? <laughs> uh, God. Uh, oh, gosh. Why are y'all uh, worshipping eggs in the chat? <laughs> eggs and Satsuki are the only ones worthy of worship. I feel like Satsuki is the type of person to join the egg cult, honestly. You still gotta do the Satsuki free time events, by the way. I don't know if we'll be able to get to them. This is a lot more fleshed out than I thought it would be. I kind of just thought it was going to be like, uh, I don't know, meme events or something. Okay. Uh. Whew. Oh, gosh. <laughs> oh, my God. Why is this game so stressful? <laughs> I can't go down there. Okay. Ooh. I didn't even notice that Monokuma up there. <laughs> Okay, okay. I don't know if I can save, because there's the, whenever the Monokuma thing is up, um, I can't save whenever it's in like a uh, zone like this. Okay. <sighs> okay, 10 medals. 10 medals, 10 medals, okay. <laughs> Okay, so the Monokuma sees up there. Try to get to the basket, I think. <sighs> okay. Um. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> no! Oh, okay. God dang it. I gotta do it all over again. <laughs> Ugh, gosh. Totally fine. Don't even care. I think these are all pretty easy, at least. Sometimes I'm like, maybe I should just die so I can, like, not have to, uh, <laughs> do all this. It's like, keep running to Monokuma to get the portal. Oh no, I died! That's so crazy! I totally didn't want that to happen. Okay, I think if I get in the middle, I should be okay, right? Probably do that. Okay. Okay, there we go. Ah, oh, man. Stupid Monokuma. When can I save again? <laughs> okay. Oh, Ryotaro's in the chat now. Nice. <laughs> I 
Okay, I don't want to get caught by this Monokuma. Where am I even going, man? I guess there's some exit after that, right? Oh, god damn it. <laughs> Maybe I should just die so I don't have to do all this. <laughs> I mean, it's a valid, it's a valid thought, you know? <laughs> it's a valid thought. <laughs> Maybe. I just wish I didn't have to keep, uh... Okay. I totally forgot about the stupid Monokuma up here. It's just when there's two of them, my brain's like, I only have one brain cell, you know, guys? So it's hard when I have two Monokumas to focus on. My brain cell is like, wait, this one or this one? <laughs> oh, God. A strategic dying. <laughs> I think, I'd say it's pretty valid. Okay, when, okay. Then he turns. What do I do? <laughs> okay, wait. I feel like there's just like the tiniest gap of time <laughs> that I can do this in. Donate your brain cells, please don't. If you have any spare brain cells, I would very much appreciate it. <laughs> Okay, there is at one point where they're both down. I'm pretty sure. Come on. Okay. Wait. Or am I just stupid? <laughs> I'm like, wait. The left corner? No, that's where I came from. Oh, God. Come on. Oh, my God. I don't know why he can't see me right now, but I'm so grateful for it. <laughs> I'm so grateful for it. Okay, 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 okay. This is the most stressful game I've ever played. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Hate you, Monokuma. Fuck off. Why you gotta do this to me? Okay. Okay, so he looks aside. Why did I do that? Why did. Oh my god, I gotta start over? <laughs> Green portal. Teruya portal, please bless me. I like to think of it as just a Teruya's little hoge, you know? I just like to think that that's Teruya. He's coming to save me with his gay Teletubby powers. And I would very much appreciate him right now. Make an egg emote for the egg cult. <laughs> I think there might be like, you know, an apple. Or there probably is like a food egg emote. Is there not? Uh, there probably is one. Oh, wait, there is... There's a dead egg. I guess that might be upsetting, though. <laughs> that might upset the egg cult. It's like the corpse of an egg. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Okay. I want to... I don't want to die. I want to do the opposite of dying right now. Dude, I really don't want to do this one again, because I don't even totally know where, like, why I... How I even beat this in the first place, to be totally honest. I just kind of winged it, and it just worked out for me. I literally- it's like I waited for him. It's like I waited for him. Oh no, it would suck if there was a portal any moment now to re <laughs> Any moment you want to save my ass? <laughs> any moment now? Not- not me dying again. This one's so hard. <laughs> it's your turn to die, literally. <laughs> okay, come on, come on, come on. I did it again. I pressed up too much. No. There's my hand slipped. My hand slipped. My hand slipped. Teruya portal. Any moment you want to save me, Teruya. I will never shame you ever again, Teruya. If you just help. If you just save my ass. <laughs> Sorry, Terry is busy selling merch to the people of Bikini Bottom. Oh, thank God. Oh, it's blue this time? I thought it was green last time. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Bless. Bless you. <laughs> Wait. I can still- No, I can't. No, I can't. Thank you very much. OMG! Is there still more? Wait. Wait, where am I even supposed to go? I guess it's supposed to go up here, right? Okay, this monocum is look easy at least. Oh, 
Oh man, let's find let's find another child. Ah, oh god, it was so hard walking through that portal. Oh man, thank god. Kenjo portal saved my ass this time since Rio was busy selling stuff in Bikini Bottom. Oh, it's always blue? I guess I just hallucinated that it was green. Man, now I can't make Taria jokes anymore. I think it's safe here. Midori, are you okay? Ah, ah, yeah, somehow. God, but... Damn it. There's too many Monokumas. There weren't that many on the previous floor. Anyways, let's take a breather here. I'm worried about your condition, too. It's okay, I can still run more. I told you we can't, and I want to rest because it's tiring me out. Who's there? Oh, wait, who are... Who are you related to? Um, Kizaragi, maybe? Oh, thank you, Lucky Star. Kiss Monokuma, die, or make an egg emote. <laughs> oh, man. I mean, I, I can try to make an egg emote. <laughs> I can try to get a, uh, a whatchamacallit. Oh, the blue chest. I think I did miss the blue chest. Rip. I'll look it up later. We'll look it up later. It'll be okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, Satsuki, too. I was like, who has blue hair? It's like, kind of, like escaping my mind. That makes sense. Probably a Satsuki's brother. Who are you guys? Why are you in this place? Uh, a guy? Oh, bless you. Hey, answer me. Wait a minute. We're not suspicious. Don't die. No ordinary person can exist in a place like this. Besides, there's a guy who called me from somewhere in here. For all I know, it could be you. I guess it's true. We are pretty sussy. Wait a second. Is your family part of Hope's Peak Academy too? What? How about- how did you- The same goes for us, so cease your boundaries and listen to our story. Alright, I'll believe. <laughs> It'll be nice to get to know him. He seems, uh, very serious compared to Satsuki, though. Seems to be like an older brother. I don't know, he seems kind of older. From what I've heard, your story seems to be true. You and I have the same purpose. And even the letters are similar. We're now- we're sure now other people besides us were also called here, Ryotara bro. Yeah, that's for certain. Say, who is it that you're looking for? My introduction was late. My name is Keisuke Uranami. Oh, yeah, he is. I came here to find my sister. I miss her so much. Satsuki, she was so cute, dude. I feel like her and Akane are, like, tied for my best girl from this game. They're both, I love them both for, like, such different reasons, you know? If you're Iranami, it's the ultimate clown. <laughs> the ultimate clown. What a talent. Satsuki Iranami, your sister. That's right. The youngest in our large family. If you heard the name, then you must know our family, too. You're Maki's younger brother of the ultimate sniper. And you are Yamaguchi's younger sister of the ultimate lawyer, correct? That's true. By the way, like Ryotaro bro said, all the students of Hope's Peak Academy are famous. Seeing that everyone knows my brother. I'm sorry for the sudden aggression. I never imagined that other family members would have been summoned together. I thought you were the culprit who kidnapped me here. No, it's okay. In such a hellish place, that reaction is only natural. So, so you said, oh wait, so you said you two were going together to find your family's whereabouts, didn't you? Yeah, the ultimate goal is to get out of here and go back to our original homes. As long as we got involved in, into this, we can't go back without any clues about our families. That's true. How the heck are they going to escape this place? Now that I think about it. It's, it's going to be pretty tough. That's true. If you don't mind, can I join you as well? I wonder where he um, like, uh, is on the age range. They said like Satsuki was the youngest, so she's like the baby of the family. I mean, like, I think she said she had like 15 siblings or something, right? Like, uh... Oh wait, she mentions, oh, she mentions him in her free time events? I haven't played her free time events. Oh, that's cool. I'm glad I played this first then. So then I'll actually know who she's talking about. That's true. If you don't mind, can I join you as well? But yeah, I'm pretty sure she said, she said she had like 15 siblings or something crazy. I was like, man, I feel like her oldest sibling would probably be like pretty old if that's the case. Oh, sure. You're welcome. Even one person can help many others. Actually, I would rather have asked you to join us. It's good to go together, because I just came down the upper floor. Oh, there are places I can't go alone. So I want you to lend me your strength. If you also need my help, please tell me anytime. All right, thank you, Mr. Iranami. You can address me comfortably. I hate making things hard. It's my motto to always live brightly. 
Is that so? Then I'll call you Keisuke. I'll call you... <laughs> the fucking phase, dude. I'll call you Keisuke, bro, too. It's nice to meet you. Right. Pleased to meet you, Ryo Ryotaru Midori. Um, is Midori mad at me? Is she evil? Uh, I met this other guy named Midori who was green, and he really, he really messed up my trust issues, man. So uh, maybe, we maybe we should just leave her behind. No, not at all. KSK, I'll explain to you later. Yeah, Satsuki has a large family tree. That's what I thought I remembered her saying. He looks like he's in his late 20s, early 30s. Yeah, I was thinking that he looked kind of old. KSK, Uranami has joined the party. Okay. Oh, thank God I can save. Not that it even matters. I'm just going to have the diamond save my ass later anyways. <laughs> oh no. Who accidentally ran into Tin Monokumas and got the... Uh, <laughs> And got the uh, thing activated. Uh, oopsie poopsie. Ryotaro Midori. Ah, uh, Keisuke bro, what's wrong? We came here after receiving a letter from someone, didn't we? The person who sent the letter said our family might be alive. Yeah, then I came here knowing it was suspicious because I wanted to check whether that statement was true or not. Uh, thank you, Teruya. So am I gonna have to break the news to them? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> we still gotta see if they survive in time first to get the news broken to them. The news is pretty, um, whatchamacallit, uh, pretty brutal, so <laughs> they might die too. We'll see. I guess if they live though, it'd probably be your job. I think Kinjo's a little too unstable. Ray's gonna say it in two, she's gonna be like, yeah, you're, that bitch of a sister you had is dead. <laughs> Oh god, you should have seen it. I feel like Ray, yeah, she'd just be like way too blunt. Oh, my hair is coming undone. Eh, rip. I just realized that. Uh, but yeah. Thanks for the donation, by the way. Same was true or not. I forgot to look at the profile. I'll do that in a second. I'm saying this because I found someone in the same situation as me, but what do you guys think of that fact? What do I think? You mean about your family being alive? I don't know, because I haven't met your family, but at least my sister, Satsuki, isn't a girl who doesn't stay in touch for years. If Satsuki were alive, she would have done anything to get in touch with me and her family. Aw, but no contact was made. Of course she would be close with her family, because she's the most precious, sweet, wonderful girl in the world. So it's Keisuke, do you think the contents of the letter are lies? Uh, I think that's unlikely. Even if Satsuki was really alive, maybe I just can say that it is not normal. That can't be. Let's beat a Lulu together, guys. Come on. Uh, sorry, I didn't mean to upset you like this. Uh, they're probably totally alive, right? Regardless of the truth, news from the dead or alive family member has arrived for the first time in a few years, so we have to check it out for ourselves. That is the purpose for coming here. Don't you? Didn't you go? Didn't you both go to the place written in the letter for the same reason? That's right, because I didn't think this had anything to do with us or whether they were alive or not, or whether we're involved. Me too, if something's related to my brother, I wanna know all the way. Only then will me and my family be able to move forward. Yeah, that's it. Sorry for suddenly stopping, let's move on. Ah, <laughs> oh, cough, cough, ah, oh, Jesus, oh no. Makes me think that like, it's coughing up blood or something since it's red. Midori, what's wrong, are you okay? Ah, uh, she's just dying. Is it another seizure? Oh wow, she's having seizures? I know it's just the asthma. Don't worry, both of you, it's fine. I'm just gonna die over here in the corner. It's okay though. Still, that complexion isn't good. KSK Midori said she was born with bad health, so she usually spends a lot of time in the hospital. I think we need to hurry. Yeah. Oh man. What if we get to meet like Mitch's sister? <laughs> I was just thinking of that because I was like, I kind of feel like. They're doing a lot of the characters that like died kind of early on or didn't. Well, no, Satsuki lived a long time. Never mind. I'm just a Lulu, right? <laughs> okay, let's um look at his profile. So I got three more characters. The seventh older brother, oh, seventh older brother of the ultimate clown, Satsuki Uranami. Oh, wow. He must, he's at least seven years older than her then. <laughs> Was her mom just having kids like every single year? <laughs> That has got to be really tiring. <laughs> He's the undisputed number one in his family circus, possessing world-class aer aerobic skills, and his personality is great that he is kind and friendly to everyone. What a bro. Oh, wait, no, I'm going to talk again. Okay, let's do her second one. Retire, bro. Keisuke, bro, is very kind, isn't he? 
Yeah, as a man, I think I. <laughs> Gay. Gay. <laughs> I can finally, I can finally replace Mitch in my heart. I think I might have found somebody else to fanboy over. Oh gosh, get this Mitch body pillow and like starts drawing like a uh, Iranami's face on it. Yes, th this can work. I can make this work. <laughs> As a man, I think I might, I think I might fall for him. <laughs> yeah, what? What did you just say? So back off, Midori. <laughs> um, I think we're both too young for him, but okay. <laughs> You're a guy, of course. The form of love is free, but oh, oh girl, homophobic. But that's too much. Okay, yeah, let's leave Midori's ass in the, in the locker. <laughs> oh, but then you seem to suit him on your own. <laughs> so do you approve or not, Midori? Are you being homophobic or not? See, if she's being homophobic, that's just more proof that she's Monokuma. Because Monokuma, as we all know, is confirmed a homophobe. <laughs> oh, gosh. Seeing you be so embarrassed by... Seeing you be so embarrassed by jokes. <laughs> yeah, jokes. <laughs> Usually have weird thoughts, Midori. Oh, man. Let's leave her ass in the locker. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, man. I'm just me big, okay? She might just be flustered. <laughs> it was just the way it came off was not super good. Ryotaro, what kind of person was your older sister? My sister? Why all of a sudden? Well, just... I think my sister mentioned her once. And I heard she's a great friend. Aww. Are you lying? Ugh, my older sister, ugh, she sucks, man. She won't even date Mitch, my idol. My older sister is the queen of complete fools. She borrows money and she comes into my room every day to tell me she, like, she loves me and shit. Ugh, so annoying. Ugh. I mess around with it and she takes everything I eat. Is that so? It's usual for that. It's usual that siblings don't get along well, but I've never been like that with my older sisters or younger sisters. Does he only have sisters? <laughs> Is he the only boy in the family? Um, your older and younger sisters? You must have a very large family, right? Yeah, I have six older brothers, seven older sisters. Okay, he does have some brothers too. Jesus. Uh, thank you, Brian Ford. I'm officially making the ship name for Keisuke and Ryotaro ship Ryusuke. Oh, that actually goes pretty well. <laughs> Everybody in the, uh, in the chat. <laughs> Oh god, hopefully she's not actually uh, homophobic. Oh, Destiny, that's just kind of like a joke we made about Monokuma being homophobic. Since in the ballroom scene, he was like, you can only date, you can only dance with the opposite gender. Just like an inside joke. Oh, man. Yeah, I have, you have six, six, seven older sisters, four younger brothers, and three younger sisters. Oh my god. Family's even bigger than I thought. Oh, what the? <laughs> How did your mom live through that, bro? Unless you have like a few different moms, like a sister wives thing going on. 20 siblings, wow. But now that I think about it, the relationship wasn't particularly bad, but it wasn't good either. How big would their house be? <laughs> like that's insane. <laughs> because we were more like competitors in the same industry than family. Oh, that's kind of awkward. Man, what does that even mean? Um, I'll tell you about that later. First, let's hurry on our way. I'll try my dumb on you later. Okay, um... Let's go ahead and die some more. <laughs> okay. Um, let's go ahead. I don't want to fight any more Monokumas or avoid them. <laughs> Is this the third floor? Well, I don't know how many floors there are in the first place. It's like, his, I feel like they're probably, I'm sure there is. Some of them are step siblings, right? That's what I was wondering too. I was like, they're not mentioning like step siblings though. You'd think that they would like, I don't know, specify? <laughs> specify if there was. I'm like, I was like, I'm sure there is somebody who's had like 20 kids, but like, I'm just trying to think of like, how young would you have to start like getting pregnant in order to have like 20 kids and like what would like the I don't know like the time frame be like in between them that'd be awful though man 
I'm scared to get pregnant once. If I'll ask, because his mom, okay, she's dead. She's dead. <laughs> Let's be real. Who, who could survive that? Oh, man, who could survive the hospital bills, dude? Thanks for the donation, though. I appreciate it. Uh, is this the third floor? Well, I don't know how many floors there are in the first place. There were no stairs going down to the place where Ryotara, bro, and I first met. So if that was the first floor, then this is the third floor, right? By the way... Oh, by the way, Keisuke, didn't you say earlier that there are places where you can't go alone? Yeah, come here for a sec. Okay. Hey, another chest. This is... It's a hole you can cross over, but as you can see, the crack is too small to get in. That's right, if it's this small, I wouldn't be able to fit in. You can't pass this if you were... You can't pass this if you were alone, right? If this is the end, I wouldn't. Now come back over here. Okay, I guess there's like another way. Oh yeah, a vent. These vents are like huge, dude. Is it a vent? This is... That's right, I think it was originally buried in the wall. But it seems to have protruded and cracked. You can enter the room where there was a hole earlier. Uh, how do you know that? Didn't you take a closer look inside the room earlier? There's a vent that looks just like this one, sticking out of the ceiling. I can't say for sure, but I think they're probably connected. Indeed, if someone goes inside this room and finds a crack, they can go inside the next one. By the way, please tell me there's no Monokumas in the vents, right? Please? That's That's gotta be a safe place. I'm just gonna take down my hairpin, dude. It's not... It's, it's not gonna work out for me. So I'm just not even gonna bother with it anymore. I don't wonder. I only had two. We'll just do the half up, half down look. Uh -huh. Not to sleep this part up. Uh, by the way, if that's the case, it wouldn't matter if you were alone, right? Oh, if you're alone, right? We have to cross it anyways. So if the reason is because of the hole in the hallway, my body is too big to fit in this vent. Ah. That's why I needed someone's help. Ryotaro, can you get in? I'll have to try. Venting sus among us. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm banging my head against it, but nothing's happening. It's too narrow for me. Is that so? I thought it was going to be a tight fit. Hey, brothers, can I go in? If it were me, I think I could fit through. But Midori, it seems too dangerous for you to go alone. That's true, considering your physical condition, regardless of whether you're young or a woman. It's okay, leave it to me. This is something only I can do, right? Oh god, just stop making that face. Just go in there, get on my sight. If I can't help you, then will I be able to... Is that why you're so angry? I understand your feelings. I don't really, but... That's not it, bro. That expression on her face doesn't mean that she's angry. Leave it to me. I'm sure I'll do well. Midori, think of the vents on the ceiling. Once you get inside, you can't get out until you find the one connected to us. There will definitely be Monokumas inside, too. We don't know what structure it may have. Will you really be okay? I was kind of wondering if uh, I'll get to play as these guys at some point. I'd be lying if I said I'm not scared, but it's the only thing I can do. So we have no choice but to do it, right? And this is fine. Even if my body is like this, can you really consider me the type of person th that I do things when I'm told? Uh, just get in the vent already, man. I don't want to look at you anymore. Fine, but think of your body as your top priority. Do not do anything reckless. If there, if there is something inside, there's nothing we can do because we can't get in. Yes, thank you, brothers. Man, I have to dodge the Monokumas in the vent. Midori sus. I saw her vent. It's not the only thing that's sus about her. Okay, I guess I'll save again. I'm just gonna keep saving over six. Well then, shall I go? Please do. Wait a moment. Let me talk to what's his face first. My uh, new crush that I'm replacing uh, Mitch with. We have no choice but to leave this to Midori. Actually, I don't want this, but let's hope it succeeds. Time to die by some Monokumas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll be back soon. Wait for me. Don't overdo it. Like her voice sounds like a witch when she does that face. Up oh, here we go. Ow, it hurts. But. It was really connected to the inside, just like KSK Bro said. I just need to go over there and break through the wall. 
Okay, I'll prove it to them that I can help too. Okay. Do 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 do. Time to do. Oh my god. Wasn't thinking for a second. I wasn't paying attention. Wait, what the? Okay, that's why I was like, <laughs> I was not paying attention for a second. <laughs> and so I just, you know, <laughs> I just, you know, ran right into him. We're just gonna pretend that didn't happen. I really do be uh, tempted sometimes to just die. So I don't have to do this. <laughs> it's okay though, it's okay. Okay, yeah, our room does look really messed up. Oh, there's so much crap on the floor. Oh, gosh. Oh my god, really? Oh, maybe I have to go into that other corner. Man, I didn't even think about that. Uh, <laughs> I even have to walk down and do this whole thing. She's taken after her brother, Ryotaro. <laughs> Oh gosh. Oh, Lanouz, you knew what you were doing, sending her to that room. Ah, oh, that's so true, man. That's so messed up. Okay, come on. Come on, girl. Yeah. So sad, man. Okay. Okay. <gasps> no! What? How? Ah! I was so quick! I tried to be quick. <laughs> oh god. I mean, I feel like is it just because I went like a step too high? I feel like I feel like that was like there's nothing else for me to do. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I don't have to keep doing this. I just want the blue crystal of life. Okay, come on, girl. Oh, you can uh, hold. Okay, cool. I feel like he's so much quicker here. Oh, it's just like quicker sometimes? That's probably what it is. Okay, so sometimes it's quick and sometimes it's not. Uh. Ah, oh, god damn it! How do I know when it's not gonna be quick? <laughs> Bro, oh my god. Oh gosh, you have died. <laughs> I'm gonna go to the bathroom really quickly. I'll be back in a second. Um, let me put Kaya here so he can uh, entertain you guys. And go for it, Kaya. Also, my room's kind of messy because we have like a kitten we're taking care of, so uh, there might be some cat toys around here. Let me mute the thing really quickly. Oh yeah, somebody read it, translate all the character sheets. Yeah, I saw that. That's, that was pretty cool. I'll be right back. Sorry guys. Do do do.
thank you for the donation thing. I appreciate it. Let me uh, get the audio back on too. Oh wow, it's almost uh, midnight for you guys. Whoa. <laughs> Kind of crazy how different uh <laughs> time zones are oh no kaya fell <laughs> that's so sad <laughs> oh thank you thing awesome stream can't wait to see you play the second thank you i'm really looking forward to uh playing the second game get the music back on but i appreciate the donation that's very sweet of you okay kaya you can try to stay in here he's probably gonna fall again i love these little plushies that i got for the genshin characters but they fall so easily like uh their little legs are like not <laughs> not meant to stand up at all like even when I like kind of place them against this it like does not work very well <laughs> okay oh uh thank you hope boyfriend I just got here and I have no idea what's going on death lots and lots of death it's basically what's going on I keep dying to these Monokuma things. Um, you have to like, whatchamacallit. Oh, please do. Okay, cool. So you just kind of press F and then you have to avoid these Monokumas and, oh, whoa, does that make, does that speed them up? It speeds up the Monokumas too. Oh my God, it does. That's kind of dope. Oh my God, you can speed up her character too. What the heck? That's kind of epic. <laughs> oh, but thanks uh, for the donation. I appreciate it. <laughs> I didn't expect it to speed up the Monokumas, too. I'm fast as fuck. Okay. She kind of looks like Ayami sometimes, too, I feel like. Oh, gosh. It's like, I don't know what point I should just, like, stop trying. <laughs> okay, so that one... I just don't understand. Sometimes he's really quick and sometimes he's like slow. Or maybe not. Maybe I'm just... No, maybe he's always quick. No, I guess he is always quick. I think I just have to be really fast then. <sighs> oh my god. Oh god. Okay, okay. Let's see. Uh, one more time. I think I have to do the, like, the same exact thing. Why is he so fast? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Okay. Like trying to make sure there's no like tricks. <sighs> uh, no, there's two Monokumas. I gotta split my one brain cell. Okay. 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 I'm probably not gonna make it through this whole thing. <laughs> like one. <laughs> I'm looking at this section too right now. I have to use three. Well, no, I guess it's still two brain cells, bro. Or is it three? Cause I gotta get through this. It's like. No, I think I have to use three brain cells for this part. Fuck. Because <laughs> I, I gotta get right here. Bro. Okay, well, at least I can go up here, down here, and then. No. When will my suffering end? <laughs> when will the Kenjo crystal come and save me? <laughs> Thank you, uh, Mary, the autistic. Autistic Egg Cult member, Lucky Star. You can do this, Weeby, thank you. I will keep trying my best. I appreciate the donation. Oh gosh. Man, the head's like chopped off. I just noticed that. Oh. <laughs> There's a safe spot next to the statue. Oh, I see it. I see it. No, wait. No, I think, um, I think, uh, right, if you're talking about right here, I think I have to get all the way, oh yeah, no, you're talking about this spot next to the statue, okay. Yeah, I think, other than that, I have to get, like, all the way down here. Okay, so, maybe when I get behind him, then I have to get rid of this Monokuma. We were always here just to suffer. 
<laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, Keisuke is can canonically older than the Danganronpa and other s survivors. He's 25. Oh, well, that's cool. Oh, the ship is uh, icky, yeah. Yeah, for sure. I mean, uh, I figured if anything, it was just like a crush. <laughs> I don't actually ship them. Just kind of like his comment made it seem like he might have had a crush. He was just pointing out that, you know, he's a good looking guy. But yeah, no, don't ship them, you know, obviously. Uh, I don't know. Dude, I just want to die, okay? I just want to die so I can get my crystal. Like, this is all... <laughs> This is all I want to do with my life, okay? Are y'all gonna judge me if I strategically die? <laughs> I don't think I can do this. I don't think I have the stamina to do this. Oh, thank you, Jesus Christ. Thank you, thank you. I, just please, just get me the fuck out of here, bro. Oh my god. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, right. I'm all good. I did it. <laughs> I feel kind of bad, though, when they're after, after I, like, skip it, they're like, wow, I did it. I'm so glad. I'm so grateful. <laughs> oh, poor Midori. She's totally gonna die. Oh, no, it actually is blood. Oh, no. She really is gonna die. Cough. It's fine. I can still hold it. I have to clear the way soon for my brothers. Thank you, Edison Ping. Ryotaro bro, KSK bro. I'm sprint I'm sprint around, but the pressing of F is tripping me up. I know it's so crazy how uh, how fast it makes you go. <laughs> it's pretty cool. I kinda wanna try it with the F. I guess I could I guess if I'm doing a death speed run, I can press the F and then just keep dying. <laughs> I might do that, honestly. <laughs> Thanks for the donation, I appreciate it. Midori! Oh, Midori! Wow, I sucked in there! Good, you guys waited here. I did it. Well done, well done, Midori. It was an unreasonable request, but thank you so much for doing this. Wait, what's that blood on your clothes? Did you get hurt? Hi, huh, yeah, this is... It's nothing. I just slightly got scratched and got cut. Isn't that too big for a little scratch? Of course not. Look at this healthy smile. <laughs> um, everywhere you look, it's a murderous smile. But still, I'm glad you're safe. Why can't she just do that smile to like the, uh, to the, to the Monokumas and just have them run away? You know what I mean? Oh, if you press G, it goes 10 times. Really? Oh, I'll try that next. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Midori, don't be a Kaido Kenny. So true, bestie. Yeah, anyways, I think we can go to the other side now. Yeah, let's go carefully. Okay. Um. Do, 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 do. Wait, where am I? Go to the other side. Like this way? Wait, what? What do they mean? Because they were talking about entering through here. It's like now we can get the hole. Do I have to go back down here? Was there something like... Oh, fuck. Like, was there something down there that I uh, could do? Oh, I can't save up here either. I can save up here though, right? Nice. Just keep saving over six. Oh wait. Ah, man. So doubt. Let me get my mouse off the screen. <laughs> okay, bottom of the art room. Can I? Oh fuck me. Ah, uh, there's still that other Monokuma down there. Yep. Oh, wait. Oh my god. <laughs> you really can't make them go 10 times. Oh, holy fuck. Oh my god, I'm so fast. Whoa. Epic. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh gosh. Okay. Okay, now I gotta think about that other Monokuma down there, too. I didn't really think about that. Imagine speedrunning this. I bet there is somebody who can, like, actually speedrun this. I see why Zeph put that note where it was like, if you only die 10 times or something, <laughs> I'll put you on my YouTube channel, because, like, this is so freaking hard, dude. It's, like, crazy. Oh, whoo! Okay. I think this is at least not too bad right now. These Monokumas are way easier than the other ones, that's for sure. Has he never looked down here? 
I feel like it's just- Oh my god! I didn't see the other stupid Monokuma! God damn it! Why is there so many of them? I hate this! I hate this game! Oh my gosh! So many Monokumas! When will my suffering end? When will it end? When will it end? <laughs> when will it fucking end, dude? <laughs> oh my god. Ugh. Okay. Ugh, let's do a monocum at the bottom. I hate it so much. I hate it so much. Cause this one's so easy. It's just like, ugh, that one. Have to do it. Okay. Okay. Okay, this one at least doesn't move. I just gotta pay attention to the stupid one up here. Oh, fast as fuck this time! Woohoo! He is a fast boy, dude. Look at him. Look at him fucking go. Okay, thank god. <laughs> oh god. I just wish the crystal stayed there, you know? It's like after... <laughs> after the first time you get the crystal, can it just like, you know, um... Always appear? <laughs> always appear? <laughs> I can just... I can just not uh, do anything else? <sighs> okay. Oh my god. <laughs> I hate this one already. Okay, I think I just need to get behind running Monokuma. And then... Fuck me, dude. I have no clue. <laughs> I have no clue what I'm supposed to do. <laughs> okay, maybe if I get up here... Maybe. Let me just get the chest first. Fuck you, Monokuma. I'm so sick of your ass. Okay. At least I got this. Okay, there is a Monokuma down here. That's what I'm, like, freaking out over. And right there, there's three Monokumas! I have one brain cell. I have one brain cell to spare, okay? I think if I... I'm like, where's that stupid fucking Monokuma down here? Okay, I was like... If I can just get past this Monokuma... Yeah, bestie, the AI devil glitch to the end. <laughs> Thank you for the, uh... Thanks for the donation, Monkey. I appreciate it. <laughs> Are you referring to Monica, though, saying the AI devil? I don't appreciate that, though. My girl who did nothing wrong. I don't know if I should risk this or not. Okay, I think I'm safe here for some reason. Thank god, this Monokuma's blind. I can't believe I actually did that! I can't believe I actually did that! Yes! <laughs> yes! Oh my god. I thought for sure I was gonna die, dude. Okay. This place looks relatively safe here. What do we do? Should we take a break here? Yes, please. Let's just take a break here. I think it would be best to... I think it would be best to hurry, but I believe it's better to take a break when we can. Um... Midori thinks so too, right? I'm already dead. Oh, no. Man, she really is gonna die during this game for sure. Yes? Oh, yeah. Ah, oh, man. Poor thing. Wait, B Midori, are you okay? Isn't your face getting pale? I'm fine. Junk Curl, you're not fine. Worry about me. Oh. oh, man. I was making a joke and I think she was actually dying. Oh, wait to slay. Thanks. Midori, what's wrong? Ah, ah. Oh gosh, she is so screwed up. Her forehead is like a fireball. Why is this happening all of a sudden? Now Midori said she was not feeling well, so she often collapses. But I wonder if she overdid it too much. All oh, those freaking Monokumas, man. This is because of me. I made Midori do a difficult task. That was something only Midori could do, and it's not your fault, bro. There's no point in blaming yourself. First, let's think about how to treat Midori. Ryotaro, did you say that when you first met Midori, she fainted like she is now? What what did you do back then? 
at that time, and fortunately, fortunately there was an infirmary right in front of me, and her symptoms didn't look as bad as they are now. It looks a lot more serious now than back then. It's too dangerous to go back to the infirmary on the first floor now, and it's way too far. I, I didn't know he way in hell I'm going back and doing those Monokumas. <laughs> unless I get a portal. Unless I get the Teruya Kenjo portal, dude. Damn it, what should I... Damn it, what should I do? Man, it'd be pretty nice if a Nori sibling showed up and if they had medical prowess. That'd be really nice. It's so upsetting that we can't help in anything like this. Pat, Pat. There's no, there's no other choice. I have to go back to the infirmary. There's no other way to heal Midori. Man, we should have brought some medicine with us. Midori, take her to the infirmary. I don't know if we can do that, though. <laughs> I don't know if we can do that, man. It's so far. Oh, wait a minute. KSK, what's wrong? Um, didn't you hear someone's voice just now? Yes, please, come on. Convenient plot person, show up. Really? I'm not sure. No, I heard it clearly. It's next to this room. Ryotaro, maybe the other people could have first the, could have a first aid kit that we need. Will it work out that well? Well, it would be better than going back to the infirmary. Do do do. Okay, let's save. Huh. Oh my gosh. This is so stressful, dude. This is the most stressful game I've ever played in my life. No, no more Monokuma. I don't want to suffer anymore. I don't want to suffer anymore, dude. Oh, hey, there they are. Okay, at least he only goes up and down. Boo, boo. Okay, he's got like a little pattern, though. You fucker. I hate you, Monokuma. Boo, dude. It's a good thing I have no peripheral vision at all. I'm just like sitting right next to him. Okay. Do, 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 do. She oh wait oh my god is that um uh Kazuna's sister? Oh I don't know who the other person is though. They kind of look like Jesus from behind. <laughs> they look like a robot in the brown hair. <laughs> Jesus is that you? Okay. This is stressing me out. You. Okay. Ha. <sighs> Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Ah, there. That. Oh. Oh. Might be like her mom or something then? Can't. <laughs> Just give her the Kazuna voice. <laughs> Can you, like, go? <laughs> Why do I sound so much like my daughter? Where are you holding me for? Uh huh. Who is this person? But where are you going all alone? If you're all by yourself, you'll die sooner than later. I don't know. I don't know who this guy is. If I was with you, I wouldn't make a difference. Would it, it wouldn't make a difference if I died. I don't even know you. That's <laughs> kind of funny. <laughs> to give her the voice. <laughs> you thought you thought I grew out of this voice, a weeby? <laughs> Bad chance. So you could have come all the way to this place because you created this. What are you? I'm a victim too, and I have to go find my daughter. Do you also have a daughter? Oh, Kanata's adoptive dad. Oh, yeah, that's true. I kind of forgot that uh, Nori, um, her uh, parents were adopted. Or she was adopted. I don't know. I don't know, you old man. If I die while looking for my daughter, then it's all over for me. I'm going to get out of here on my own. So if you want to find your daughter, then find her or die. You think I give a shit? Do whatever the hell you want. I wonder where Kazuna got her uh, lovely personality from. <laughs> I wonder. Wait, hey. Oh, thank God. That's so convenient. Please revive her. Um, are you okay? M more people. Who are you guys? I guess I'm like a nerdy voice. Uncle, didn't you get a strange letter asking you to come somewhere if you want to find your family? Oh, then you guys too. Oh, him too. So then you didn't know that? Yeah, do you see that woman who just ran away? When I met that person and looked at her situation, I had a hard time guessing that there would be people in the same situation as us. But... So her too. What's going on with that woman? And eh, she's got a nasty personality. Keisuke, wait, more importantly... <laughs> I Lee Rage, Kazuna mom kind of blushed though. I, I don't know if I would get near her after... Uh, 
I mean, she seems pretty similar to Kazuna so far. And we know from Kazuna's free time events that she's, you know, a little cray cray. So I don't know if I would be going, uh, I don't know if I'd be going for Kazuna's mom. You gotta look at the hot crazy scale, you know what I mean? See where the hot and the crazy matches up. If she's anything like her daughter, dude, I think she might be a little too high up on the crazy part of the scale. Keisuke, wait, more importantly, thanks for the donation. Um, meeting like this, but I can't tell that after looking at your clothes. Can I guess that you're a doctor? Yeah, I am, but... Who's that behind you that you're carrying? I oh, just a little dead girl. A doctor. What good luck. Please, I'll pay whatever money you want later, so please treat this girl. She collapsed suddenly, and I don't know the symptoms, and I think it's an emergency. Ah, huh. can I look at her condition for a minute? Oh, uncle is a common way to address older men from kids. That's kind of what I was thinking. I think it's, uh, yeah, like a Korean uh, thing. I watch a lot of K-dramas, so... I'm kind of used to seeing it, and I read a lot of manhwas as well, so a lot of times, like, translations will just translate it to, like, uncle. I made a rough diagnosis for now. There seems to be almost no water in the intestines. Oh, uh, she, like, dehydrated. And there are several complications besides that. How did she get to this point? This girl. Midori said she wasn't feeling well from the moment she was born. So she spent most of her years in the hospital. She, even being like that, she overworked herself in a place like this. Midori. This girl's name is Midori? Oh shit. Oh shit, I played Yurta to die just recently. No, not Midori! The flashbacks, the flashbacks! Uh, are, are you okay, sir? No, I'm not okay. I gotta get the fuck out of here. She's Miss Midori Yamaguchi? That's right, but how did you know? Alright, that's what my daughter told me. So then the people called her, called here, are not related with each other, but only their families. Let's talk about that later. So is Midori okay? Currently, she's in a dangerous state. I need to do a simple surgery. A first aid would work. Surgery? At a place like this? The only things in my bag right now are simple tools. But it's possible if it's a first aid at least. Fortunately, this child is now unconscious, so there is no need to worry about anesthesia. I feel like it would still hurt, though. But I guess she might be, like, really knocked out. Of course, she might wake up on the way. And it is a pretty reckless decision. But if you leave her like this... Please, I'll do anything, so please heal Midori. I'll definitely give you the money later. No, you misunderstand me. I don't need money. Rescuing a person who is in trouble in this place. Not only this place, but the entire world is devastated by de best desperate events. We can't accept patients in hopes of getting paid in return. It is my duty as a doctor to save a person's life. I'll start the operation right away. Homie, do you have anything to work on her with? So please, both of you, help me out a little bit. What can we do? There is a Monokuma right- <laughs> No, no. You must dodge 50 Monokumas! <laughs> that is all I ask from you, Weeby. No, anything but that! There is a Monokuma right down below this room. One person, please guard so that the Monokuma doesn't come this way. Okay, good. And the other one, the woman who just ran away. Please go after Miss Tamori. Ah, uh, yep, she is. And bring her back. That ant? Why? I guess it's like another uh, Korean thing. Even Miss Tamori is the first- Miss Tamori is the first person I've ever met here. Even though she's a bitch. I mean, nervous. Because of her personality, she will die soon if we leave her alone. It looks like she's a- It looks like she's a super hysterical looking auntie. Should we really save her? Even if she's such a person, she's still a human being living here. <laughs> Thank you, Edison Ping. We be your humor is something else sometimes. I appreciate that. <laughs> Thanks for the donation, by the way. I can't tolerate such a thing. Oh, thank you, Five Hawks, for becoming an Omelander. Also, I really enjoyed uh, your meme earlier. <laughs> Thanks. I can't tolerate such a thing. I said earlier that I didn't want anything in return, but if I had to say it, in exchange for operating this child, take care of Miss Tamori. So let's call this our exchange condition. All right, even though I said this, that she was an aunt, she's still a woman. If you treat Midori, I'll do my part. Like, what does that mean? <laughs> Even though she's still an ant, she's still a woman? <gasps> Hurry up, she may not have gone far. If she goes far away, Miss Tamori could be in danger, and everyone who goes looking for her could end up in danger as well. Please don't overdo it, and bring Miss Tamori back to safety. Ryutaro, you stand guard here. I'll pick up Miss Tamori. Oh, cool, I get to play as him. It's my turn to kill you, yay! It's your turn to die. 
No, case case. Stand guard. I'll go. Uh, but, but mom said it's my turn for Weeby to kill me. We only got here. We only got help from Midori. We only got help from Midori earlier, and I can't rely on my younger sister. Leave this to me. Please. Please, let me do it. Since I've been playing soccer a lot, I'm confident in my speed. Oh my god, I'm just like my Mitch, my idol, Mitchy Witchy. <laughs> Don't worry, I got this. Ryotaro, you're also very stubborn. Well, if you're faster, alright. You better come back safely. Yeah, please, take care of Midori. Do, 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 do. Can I save here? No, I guess not. I'm counting on you, Ryotaro. Doctor, Doctor Uncle. <laughs> yeah, I think like bro is kind of like Opa. I think in um Korean or something like that. Maybe I think it's like you just reference it to like somebody who's like older than you that you're like close with. I think so. I figure that's probably what they're translating bro to. I just figured I'd mention that since I'm a Korea boo. Kind of. I probably even got that wrong. Doctor Uncle, Doctor Uncle. I can't. That's so funny. <laughs> Doctor Uncle is preparing for surgery. I hope that Midori can be healed safely. Uncle Doctor is preparing for surgery. After uh, he does surgery, she comes back and she's like, Ew, Weeby, it's actually me! You're turned to die, Midori! Aren't you happy that Doctor Uncle saved me? Oh, I'm so stoked! <laughs> Kill it with fire. Do Oh shit, I just saw that Monokuma down there, dude. Going super fast. Oh, the box? Oh yeah, there was a box, wasn't there? Almost forgot about that. And <laughs> Doctor Who. Good one! Shit, where was I? Where did I come from? It's like down here. You've obtained item note three. Rip op two. Uh, op is only used by younger females to older males. Young is likely to be used in this case. Oh, okay. Nice. Thanks for the correction. What's missing? I'm trying to do this, but why the hell are you doing this to me? I want to be recognized. Is it wrong to be recognized? Then what's the point of trying? I have no idea who's writing these notes. Not the piss floor again. When are we gonna run into bitch? I'm so sick of this bitch erasure. Cause like, I already see the two spots and it's probably gonna be Inori's dad and it's gonna be um, Kazuna's mom. And it's like, why? Why all the bitch erase eraser? This is the perfect time for him to show up. Yay, the piss floor, your favorite. Do, do, do. Everybody's favorite piss floor. Do, 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 do. Fuck me, dude. <laughs> that scared me, dude. <laughs> oh my god, he's so fast. <sighs> Whew. Okay, I guess I need to go down when he's like right after he runs, right? Do, 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 do. Oh my god, there was another fucking. <laughs> There's another one down there? Why? Why am I only here to suffer? Anytime you want to show up with that crystal. Anytime anybody wants to give me a crystal, I am down. Whoa! No! Zoomy Kumas. Oh my god. It's fine. 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 Went down too far. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. More like no, no song. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. Da, 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 da. Okay. Oh my god. Okay. Oh my god, there's two Monokumas. No, my brain can only handle one at a time. You can only handle one at a time, dude. Is it fat? Is it easy? It's probably not easier to speed it up, right? Let's do a G. <laughs> I can't even keep up with the Monokumas anymore. Oh gosh. I wonder if I do G, if it'll just be too fast and they can't even they can't even see me, right? Fast as fuck! Oh, thank you, Opta! This game is such a troll, I know. I know. Dude, if there wasn't unlimited lives, I would be so screwed. I would just watch the cutscenes. I mean, I basically just abuse the crystal anyways, but, you know. Okay, come on. Oh my god. Literally. How do I do this? It's like they're synced up just to fuck me over as much as possible. Wait. Okay, no. I think for like one second they're both looking a different way. Yeah, when they're both looking to the side. Oh, okay. That worked too, whatever. 
Okay, 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 okay. I think I get down here and I'm good, right? Boom, and peekaboo! And peekaboo! Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Jesus Christ. This is so stressful, dude. I don't know if I've ever played a more stressful game than this. No, no! <laughs> There's so many Monokumas! No! God damn it! How am I supposed to beat that? Oh my god! There's like so many more at the bottom! I thought there would be a break. I thought there would be a break. Who <laughs> the fuck can beat I wanna see if there's somebody who can beat this game, dude. Just just take me away from this guy. Just take me What is that? What is that monstrosity up there? Oh my god, what is this? Monokuma Army! <laughs> oh my god, dude. Oh my god. <laughs> there's so many fucking Monokumas down there. I thought it was gonna get better. It just always gets worse. Always gets worse, dude. It just never, I can never have a day of rest in my life, huh? Oh my god. <laughs> oh. 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 Okay. Okay. Oh. At least this one's pretty easy to get. Leave me alone, Monokuma. I would like to be left alone for the rest of my life. Monokuma conga line. <laughs> You have taken no four. I was like, I wonder how much more I had to do from that. Disgusting child. She wants to press me only because she is a contributor. The person who's here is me. Why can't I be the best? And do I always lack something? Why? 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 Um, Sigoy. <laughs> I don't know, man. That's uh, that's pretty uh, sad. Random person who probably made a killing game at some point. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, hey, there she is. I just noticed her there. No, 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 no. Okay. And this Monokuma is pretty slow, at least. I probably could have gone farther, honestly. I'm just so fucking paranoid, man. Like, I'm so paranoid. <laughs> Okay, I think this is probably the best place to hide though. I don't know what the fuck this thing this monokuma is doing man um... Oh, you met my fam family the monokonga line <laughs> Monokonga. Oh, man <laughs> Thanks for the donation. I appreciate it. That was pretty memey. Oh, no, I should have sped it up when we saw the monokonga line. That would have been fun Okay I feel like I'm just gonna have to wing it, to be totally honest. Like, I don't know if my brain can process all of this that's going on here, so... Oh! <laughs> da, 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 da. That was not... That was not a very poggers moment. <laughs> I don't know why, but I keep saying that. My new sleigh. I think... I say I just wing it, but how I wing it? <laughs> I don't understand how to beat that stupid Monokuma. He's doing all kinds of crazy shit and I just don't really know that like... You know, if I die, I die. If the crystal wants to come and save me, then it's like... I welcome it with open arms. I really don't have to wait here, do I? This Monokuma is pretty slow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. No, no, no. I hate this game. <laughs> I keep dying. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. I don't know how the hell I beat this Monokuma. Man, if he could just, like, go in one direction, it wouldn't be so bad. Down goes to the right. Okay. Down he- wait, no, yeah. Is he gonna go to the right again? Yeah, he goes to the right when it's down, so. Okay, I'm gonna use that to my advantage. Oh! Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Okay, okay, I gotta be a little bit fat. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god! 
Uh, no, 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 no. <laughs> I forgot to put that stupid Monokuma down there. <laughs> oh god, okay. Oh, I'm just so used to being hung up on these guys. Do, do, do. Okay. Down goes to the right. How do I use that to my advantage? I guess I also go to the right. That's probably the best idea, right? Because I keep going to the left. I think he's like just sometimes in a different spot. Wait. Okay, and he's going to the right. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I can't do this. I'm so fast. <laughs> yes, get the crystal. <laughs> She's, I just feel like such a dumbass, dude. She's right there. She's right fucking here. Why can't I get to her? Why can't I get to her? Why? Why can't I get to her, dude? She's right fucking there. I kind of want to try one more time. Because I feel like I'm so close to getting it. Fuck off, Monokuma. Fuck you. I'm doing this to spite your ass. Okay. Oh, I think that's why. Okay, so sometimes he's looking up. I think sometimes I've been doing it when he's, like, looking up. And I do it when he's not looking up. Yeah. Wait. Yes. No. Yes, no. No! <gasps> no! <gasps> no! <laughs> no! God damn it, I was so close! <laughs> no, damn it, I just want to pass it! I just want to pass it! <laughs> one more time, one more time, one more time, one more time, one more time. I can do this, guys, I promise! I can do this! <laughs> Everything's gonna be okie dokie. Just as Monica would say, my beloved. <laughs> okay. okay, okay. I hate this Monokuma! <laughs> I hate it! <laughs> oh my god. Okay, okay. Okay, we don't want him to do that. Okay. Oh my god, he's so fast! <laughs> you do have to hide in the sides, huh? You do. You do have to hide in the sides. <sighs> okay. One more time? <laughs> oh god damn it. <laughs> I think I've lost my mind. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Fuck you, Crystal. I don't need you. Okay. <laughs> We're gonna get here. Oh, there's another crystal over there. <laughs> you died so many times. You get a second crystal, Weeby. <laughs> Oh god! Oh, thank you, Lucky Egg! Take the goddamn crystal weepy! Never! Never! Okay. You can't make me take the crystal! Oh my god. Oh god. Weepy is all good now! Oh god, I've lost my mind, dude. I didn't need my one brain cell anyways. We be take the crystal for the love of Makaru. <laughs> if I die one more time, I'll take the crystal. <laughs> but for now, we're gonna fucking wing this shit, baby. Okay, 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 okay. I just need to go whatever direction he's going in, right? I'm so scared, though. No fuck. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> so stressful. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay, okay. Yes! I fucking did it! Yes! Slay! Fuck you, Monokuma! Fuck up! Fuck you! Okay, 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 we're good. <laughs> Whew! Uh, oh my god, that was fucking crazy. You're really losing it, Weeby. Uh, I guess somebody. Somebody help me. <laughs> Auntie. Did you just call me Auntie? Uh, who are you? The doctor asked me to bring you back. <laughs> Why do I sound like that? <laughs> the doctor asked me to bring you back, Auntie. 
Were you trembling here after running away from your anger with uncle? I also lost my mind doing that puzzle. Trembling? Who's trembling? <laughs> no, I sound like the spirit Junko. Who are you? Who are you to say such things to me? Do you even have that house education? I'm one of the people who came here after receiving a letter asking if I wanted to check if my family was alive or not. Auntie, you seem to have confirmed that fact. The doctor, that fact with the doctor too, right? Uh, then that wasn't a wild thought. Anyways, Auntie, the doctor is worried. It's dangerous to go alone on your own. Oh, let's go back. Let's solve that Monokuma puzzle again. God, I'm so stoked. And you were shaking in here. Come on, let's go back together. Who said I was shaking? It's useless to worry about me. I'm alive, kid. I don't even want to go back to that old guy. If you continue to be... Aren't you kind of old, too? If you continue to be stubborn like that, then I'll go on my own. I feel like you guys are, like, the same age. Oh, wait a minute, kid. Are you just going to leave me and go? Just don't do it on the... Just don't do that on the other ones, please. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> I don't know if I can make any promises. When I get so close like that, you know, it's like, I just want to freaking solve it. But thanks for the donation. <laughs> Didn't you just say it's useless to worry about you? Um, okay, okay, I'm going back. Did you even learn proper home education? Follow me. Oh, God. Oh, wait a second, dear. Why? My legs are shaking and my feet are not moving. Can you? Oh my god, girl, do I gotta carry you? Do I gotta carry you? Hey, you sure change a lot, auntie. <laughs> Imagine Miss Tamori popping and locking this level. <laughs> we could see that. <laughs> I'm just popping and locking over here. I was having a great time, okay? Things like that happen. Do you know how scared I was? If you were a little late, I'd be caught and killed right away. And I want you to stop calling me an aunt. My name is Monaco Tamori. Call me sis. <laughs> Call me Monaco. I'm young and hip, okay? I'm totally not a boomer. Okay, let's go, Miss Makako. Oh, wait. <laughs> okay, let's go, Miss Makako. Um, I can hold your hand like this, right? Hey, yeah, that's a little better. Thank you. Let's go. Besides the doctor, my party is waiting too. <laughs> oh, wait. What else? Uh, well... Let me light a cigarette. Wait a moment. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> I gotta get my buzz going, okay? It's pretty tough being around all these fucking Monokumas, you know? <laughs> Have you seen Weeby? You've died more than five times. Can I... Wait. Is this gonna take me back or should I just die the Monokuma? I can't tell. I think if I die, it'll just take me back anyways, right? Uh, cause I... Honestly, I could uh, maybe use this later. Let me see if I die, if um, I'll be fine. Oh no, don't kill me, Monokuma. You're so swag. <laughs> You're so hot. Oh no, he killed me. That's so sad. I'm crying. Oh, okay, never mind. Damn it. I was hoping he would give me to the beginning. Okay, I guess I'll use him and it's fine. Okay, use it. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, 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 no. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> That's cool. That's cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. Whatever. Let's get the hell out of here, bro. Oh, wait. Oh, my God. Do I have to go through whatever shit that was that I didn't have to do before? This is the most painful game on Earth. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, wait. Oh. What are those Monica is doing here? Woo! Looking. Looking in the window. In the ballroom. Is that the ballroom? Um, uh, um, I don't know what to do. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, yeah, G, the Pakongo line. That's true. I gotta, I gotta do that. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Spin in a circle. Oh, God, I'm getting dizzy, Weeby. I kind of, oh, shit. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> My bad. I wanted to see if maybe speeding it up would make it easier somehow. <laughs> But it does not seem like it. My bad. Oh, fuck me. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, gosh. I was, like, worried about having to shoot Monokumas because I was like, oh, it'd be kind of, like, hard for, like, the aim or whatever. 
but I'm kind of wishing I could just fucking shoot these Monokumas, dude. Ew. Ew. Um, should I just, like, follow behind this Monokuma? I just don't know if that's gonna work. Because, like, uh... Oh, thanks for coming, Demon Slayer fan. Uh, Lana, thanks for, uh, coming. Hope you have a good night. Okay, um... Oh, fuck. Uh, why does there have to be another Monokuma there, dude? Ugh, oh, this is not very Slay of you, Monokuma. Oh! And no, 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 no! <laughs> yes, yes, lay crystal. <laughs> Give me the crystal. <laughs> oh God, yes. Oh, thank God. <laughs> thank you, Jesus. <laughs> Thank you, Slay! <laughs> oh wait, I wanted to try to see if I could hold down G. <laughs> oh, gosh. Son, why don't we... <laughs> hey, son, why don't we take a break? My legs hurt. I take another month off. Now, we, if we go downstairs, we can go where the dock is. So be patient. And how many cigarettes have you smoked since then? It's getting through my nose, so please turn them off. And this is very important. How many sermons is this little guy... How many sermons can this little guy do? Did you even get home education? She says it so much. Are you stupid? What do you want to do with their families? Uh, Auntie, didn't you hear a human voice just now? Um, I heard it. Oh, oh, my, oh no, it's Gray Man. No, not evil Gray Man. <laughs> Yes, as long as we secure Yuki Maida in between. It doesn't matter what happens. The Kizaragi Agency is also on the move. Ah! Oh, okay. I'll take care of this for you. Tell him to make sure he does his job. I'll hang up. Anyways, anyways, there's crazy guys. How much do you think it costs to reproduce this lab? The rest of my family seems to be coming up soon. We'll have to pre prepare them. What? Who do they just... Uh, weren't they talking about families? And they're the culprit. It's the culprit who brought me to this place. Calm down, Auntie. <laughs> Don't call me that. If that's the case, it doesn't change that we have to join the others for now. Let's go down first. Uh, son, if we go after them now, don't you think we'll be able to get out of here? Huh, Auntie, what are you saying? Uh, don't join the others. Let's chase after that guy and catch them. And then we can escape together. <laughs> Fuck those guys. <laughs> Fuck them, kids. Are you being serious right now? I mean, oh, it's not my fault she has, like, cancer or whatever. Jesus. <laughs> I don't want to go back to that old guy. Why does she hate him so bad? <laughs> Besides, what if that person gets out of here while going downstairs with the group? Stop being ridiculous. The rest of them are waiting for us. Even if that guy is the culprit, I have to go back. There's a patient left behind. Let me tell you right away. I hate these types of aunties like you. They smell like cigarettes and they're all mean. And they talk like valley girls. I would have left you all alone if that doctor didn't tell me to bring you. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at this guy. Is that what you say to your adults? If you keep saying stuff like that, it's only auntie who gets thrown away. I said we're going back. We're going back, bitch. Oh, wait a minute, kid. My legs are still... I'm gonna have another smoke. That'll help me with my... Uh... That'll help me with my legs, right? Okay, okay, I'll go back. Damn it, kids these days are really... Oh, gosh. He's definitely the culprit. He's gray. Oh, hey, she looks better. Uncle, Keisuke, I brought Auntie. Oh, you're here. Uh, wait. <laughs> I was like, who's talking? Dr. Midori is... Ray Taro, bro! He really do surgery, man? Um, Midori, are you okay? You woke up already. She still needs a rest a bit, but the resistance on her body is greater than you think. It's probable after a long battle with illnesses, her body has become suitable for treatment. She felt refreshed a little while ago. Brother, I'm sorry. I caused another big inconvenience again. No, I'm glad you're up again. More than anything, everything is good. <laughs> she all good now. I'm glad that Ryotaro also brought her safely, and even Midori is healthy again. Midori is all good. 
Mr. Mori, are you okay? Are you hurt anywhere? <laughs> Stop pretending to care. I didn't come here because I wanted to come back. I apologized. I forced you too hard on my desire to find my daughter. You too must have had your own thoughts. But I also don't think it'll be easy to get out of here. So why don't we take a little bit of peace of mind and act together for once? Uh, uncle, that aunt was sitting alone and trembling. Shut up, kid. I've never done that. I was popping and locking. Excuse you. <laughs> well, I can't go alone. <laughs> oh, bless you. Because I know it's dangerous to go alone. I was a bit harsh. I appreciate your understanding. These people are also in the same situation, so let's talk about it. Whew, man. Actually, all good now. I see the same letter without a single mistake. It is for certain we are all aimed for the same person. I'm pretty confident of this. And Ryotaro Maki. I wondered where I heard that name before. My daughter brought a friend once to my house. <laughs> she had a friend? The child's name is Maki. After hearing that, I thought my sister also mentioned that she was close to her. Oh, cool. She was probably the older sister who was the class leader in the school. Once the five of us have gathered, we can see one thing in common when we put our stories together. That's kind of interesting that they were uh, friends. Or, you know, it seemed like pretty close. It goes without saying that each of us was a family of Hope's Peak Academy students. The fact that each of uh, the students had an acquaintance with each other. Even with Ryotaro's older sister or that lady's daughter. I heard that and thought, uncle, is your name Inori? Among my older sister's classmates, there is one person named Kanata Inori, she was the sweetest, who entered Hope's Peak Academy with a talent as a doctor. Uh, ah, Kanata. She is my daughter. However, my last name is not Inori. I guess, yeah, she kept her uh, old last name. Oh, what kind of joke is that? Ah, uh, come to think of it, I've never revealed my name to Miss Tamori or Maki's friends. Pardon me, my name is Hikaru Ando. No. Oh. I am significant, but I am proud of myself as a doctor. I'm an ordinary person. Ando. It's like, if you're Ando, you're a top-notch doctor in Japan who strives for patients' welfare and travels around the world to provide free treatments, right? I'm not that famous. I'm just an ordinary doctor. And doctors don't need reputation nor fame. So is Kanata's sis not your daughter? Yes, it's a bit hard to say it here, but I picked Kanata who lost her parents in an accident. When she was very young, but she was a really good kid and she shared her affection more than her own parents. Although we're not connected by blood, I can proudly say that she is a wonderful doctor. And Mr. Ando, I must apologize about earlier. I didn't even know that you were such a great person. Wow, Auntie changed her attitude in an instant. Shut up, you fucking kid. Why do you keep crawling on this woman's skin? <laughs> Jesus. And I told you not to call me Auntie. Anyways, I knew Miss Yamaguchi because my daughter once told me about her. Her friend's sister was ill and she went to see her often. Okay. Because Kanata's sis was a really kind person. Of course, I need to find my brother too. I know. Inori was the sweetest dude. So sad. I hope we find her together. Yes, let's find them. Ryotaro's older sister, Midori's older brother, and Ando's daughter. Miss Tamori's daughter and Iranami. Let's find them. Now that things have turned out like this, I'll ask you guys. How about Uncle Ando and Aunt Tamori? <laughs> Stop calling me aunt! Look around their families with us. Miss me not co. Not auntie, you fucking brat. Thank you for saying that, Miss Maki. To find... Oh, Mr. Maki. <laughs> My bad. To find someone. The more people, the better. Let's join forces together. Hey, wait a moment. I'm the opposite. If we die looking for our families, we won't be able to win in a fight against those things. Besides, it doesn't look like my daughter is still alive no matter how much I look. My daughter also died on the day of the most desperate event in human history. It's clear this letter is a trap to imprison us, but you came here anyway, so you know you have some hope. Then, then my brother is dead? That's too much! Auntie, you're talking too much. Even if you're determined on that, don't say your thoughts in front of the children. And if you're so sure, then why the hell did you come here then? Didn't Auntie follow the instructions, even though it was a suspicious letter, in order to find your daughter? Stop calling me Auntie. Of course I did. As a mother, if I find my daughter is still alive, it's only natural that I want to see her. But can you really say your families are still alive in a place like this? In the first place, kids. I don't know if she even wanted to become who she was. She was a shy kid. The kind of kid that doesn't listen and spend 
The kind of kid that doesn't listen and spends money flat. She doesn't like it, even if her mom introduces her to a job. <laughs> she will not fucking work. But that didn't mean... But that didn't mean her... That meant... That, that didn't meant her to go to Hope Speak Academy. Wait. But that didn't mean for her to go to Hope Speak Academy to earn a living. Should I risk my own life to find such a kid? God, I fucking hate my daughter. <laughs> oh my gosh. Isn't she your daughter? How can you say such things? Miss Tamori. It's important that your blood is connected. It is. Even though there's no connection similar to mine in Kanata, I feel a bond that was more than a real parent. Let's just let's just say, in case your real daughter may be alive right now, will you say will you still say that you don't care? Can you really call yourself a mother? Um <laughs> It's probably just a secondary. Eh? Come on now, don't fight. Let's just calm down. Mr. Mori is also in a dangerous situa situation with our necks exposed. So we're just nervous, right? Okay, my thoughts jumped too fast. <laughs> Sorry, I was nervous. Yes, yes, I understand. So Mr. Mori is not against the idea of working with us. Hey, you're kind. Did you say you were Keisuke? <laughs> I'm just gonna, <laughs> gonna prowl on him. I will not complain if I get to see your face. Would you like to smoke a cigarette with Andy? <laughs> I'm dead, cougar. <laughs> oh no, it's fine. I don't smoke. Auntie, don't go pulling moves on Keisuke. <laughs> and didn't you tell me not to call you Auntie? When you just call when you just called yourself Auntie? Seriously, what a discrimination. <laughs> You're missing some years, cheeky brat. It seems to have gotten a little bit more lively now that it's crowded. <laughs> ah, cough, cough. Miss Yamaguchi, are you feeling unwell? We're still at a level where I've only given it first, so it's probably a little childish. I've got some liver painkillers, but if things get worse, please speak to me anytime. Oh yes, thank you, Dr. Andu. <laughs> uh, um, well, if you have any other complaints. <laughs> Uncle Ando, if you're asking because of Midori's expression, please ignore it. That's hereditary. <laughs> oh, uh, what's that? It's so funny. Oh gosh, I like her. She's pretty funny. <laughs> There are more people who don't like it, but somehow we've gathered quite a bunch of individuals. Looking out for each other as much as possible, we decided to collaborate and provide clues about our families. Working together in order to find their families safely and escape from here. That would be the best scenario. <laughs> oh god, she's pretty funny. After waiting for Midoriya's condition to calm down a little, the five of us gathered and decided to head upstairs. Yay, you get to do it again! Aren't you excited, Weeby? You get to do that same puzzle one more time. Oh god, I'm so stuffed. <laughs> I might start just running into Monokumas on purpose. <laughs> I would like to not be judged for that if I do hypothetically do that. Alright, I have something to say to everyone. What is it, Mr. Ryotaro? Actually, when I went down to the third floor with Aunt Tamori earlier, we heard a suspicious voice on the stairs. Gray, man. Oh yeah, that's right. I wanted to ditch you guys to chase after him. A voice that wasn't any of us talking to someone on the phone. Talking about families and other stuff. How many cigarettes does she have, dude? Families? Was it talking about us? Is it? Is it another family member of Hopeseek Academy students in the same situation as us? Uh, no, I don't think so. It wasn't like that, rather. It sounded like the person who sent us that letter. I thought they were the culprit who brought us to this place. I see. I thought we were brought here for a purpose, so I thought the culprit would still be somewhere around here. If that is true, that person may know Satsuki's. The whereabouts of the families we're looking for. Yeah. They're dead, homie. I wonder if we're going to see the reaction to finding out that their family members are dead. Ugh, that's going to be pretty sad. Yeah, besides, they're the culprit, so of course they would know how to get out of here. We need to find them and kill them. Wouldn't that be dangerous if they're a person who commits crimes of kidnapping and confinement? No, it's already a dangerous situation anyways. The Monokumas here are more dangerous. And there was no exit on the fourth floor. It's the same as heading upstairs. But don't worry, Mr. Ando. With the strong Ryotaro and me, we can protect everyone. Oh my, Keisuke has a good heart and a good face too. <laughs> I should have said this sooner. So then heading upstairs and finding that suspicious person is connected to all of our goals, right? Yeah, it's dangerous, but let's work together to proceed with caution. <laughs> She's so funny, dude. <laughs> See, Minako isn't completely crazy, so something's okay. <laughs> she is very pretty. Oh, gosh. She's pretty funny so far. I like her. 
<laughs> okay, thanks for the donation, by the way. Uh, Isley Rage. Do, 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 do. Oh, we have one more person still? Yes, bitch, is still, is still on his way here. Or a Michika, Mitch's sister. The foster father of the ultimate surgeon, Kanata Inori. Although he's excellent, he has excellent skills as a doctor, he doesn't show off and only concentrates on saving lives. His stepdaughter also received a lot of respect thanks to his fame. The biological mother of the ultimate cheerleader, Kazuna Tamori. She has a superficial ideology that puts beauty first. So she has a career in high-end custom shops. And that seems to have put a considerable influence on her daughter. <laughs> yeah, they're pretty similar. <laughs> do -do -do. Let's talk. Do -do -do. Let's talk to Midori first. Ryutaro, bro. Thanks for helping me not die. How, how it is it, Midori? If we get out of here safely, is there anything you want to do after? So suddenly, let's get an ice cream cone. Well, even if I wanted to do something, I don't think much because the world is kind of a mess wherever you go. But to put it bluntly, I guess, a, a lover. A lover? <laughs> I don't know. I'm still joking. Still in the situation. It's more realistic than money or game consoles. Being a lover is... It doesn't matter to me, but Ryotaro bro doesn't seem to like... Oh, God. I don't I don't think he was implying you, girl. <laughs> I don't think he was implying that. I think he was just making a joke. A child like body shaped like mine and it seems like an impossible request. What? What are you talking about, dude? It was just a joke. It, it was a joke? Ah, uh, uh, that's right. I was like, how old is she anyway? She seems really young. But why were you asking such a thing all of this all of a sudden anyways? I mean, I guess it could also be because she's like uh kind of sick. Maybe she hasn't been able to, like, grow as much because of that. When I lost consciousness, while being seriously ill, unconsciously I heard Ryutaro Bro's words asking for me to, asking to treat me no matter what. I haven't done anything and I only caused so much trouble and I've only been helped by Ryutaro Bro. I mean, you helped us earlier. If I can't repay the favor after all this, I'll really become useless. So, so you want to do something about it? Yeah. Then do me one favor. A favor? What is it? Don't blame yourself again and don't say things like that ever again. That's what I want. He's a good dude, even though he's kind of a tsundere. Be more proud of yourself. You always talk like you committed a sin, but the bad thing here is your illness. How many times do I have to say it for you to understand? But... Say, if we get out of here, would you like to... Come on a... <laughs> what is their age gap? I was like, I... <laughs> I just don't know, so I'm like, what? Would you like to go on a date with me? Date? The dating part was a joke, but let's hang out. If you get out of here, you won't just say goodbye to the people you met here, right? Of course not. A date. If you're okay with me, then please. Just don't make that face. You're a really hardworking girl. Okay, let's, um... I guess they're close in age. She just looks really, uh, young. Ryotaro, would you like to catch a break and chat for a while? Sure, I don't mind. You said you were curious about what I was doing last time, didn't you? Oh, that's right. What kind of family members are called as competitors? What do you do? What do you work as, Keisuke? My family members. We all work together as one. Work together? Okay, the age gap is just one year. Okay, cool. I was like, I didn't know. I was like, I don't know. Like, she just looks really young to me. That's why I was like, I don't really know. But that's good. <laughs> oh, that was a uh, Chinese. Oh, that was Chinese. The Lineage, lineage itself continues in China. I'm talking about the circus. Wait a minute. Come to think of it, the younger sister you're looking for was also the ultimate clown, right? Besides your sister, the whole family is a circus troupe? Yeah, that's why it's a large family. Not all of them are from the parents. Okay. And in some cases, there's those who have been adopted. Okay, that makes sense. Thank God. God bless Satsuki's mom, though, still having to take care of all those kids. I couldn't see it. I couldn't see it at all because you had a clean and handsome face. So then, Keisuke, you're the type that does three flips in the air, or do you jump off a rope in a human pyramid? I don't know what you're talking about, but I think I'm the ace of our family, so maybe... That's amazing! Show me something! Uh, right now? I could show you, but in these shabby ruins, if I did it, the floor would collapse. That's right, I didn't think about that. 
Well, whenever we get out of here, I'll show you. It's not that difficult to do. Still, that's pretty cool. The whole family is a circus troupe. Something that looks fun and feels great. It's not as cool as it may seem. As a result, because of this family's characteristics, they pushed Satsuki to move to Hope Speak Academy, and it had to come to this point. Aww. Keisuke made a gloomy face and said no more. Did I say something wrong, or... Aww, he really misses his sister! I don't blame him, dude. Satsuki's just like the freaking best, dude. <laughs> the best girl. Mr. Ryotaro, do you have some free time? Oh yeah, what's wrong, Mr. Ando? What is it? Uh, I keep, like, forgetting the name for a second. Was Maki... What, was Maki Kiyoka Ryotaro's sister? Yeah, she's a fool. A big fool. Ah, uh -huh, you seem to get along well. Mr. Ry <laughs> you seem like a tsundere. Mr. Ryotaro looks a lot like your sister, don't you think? Eh, where are you even looking? Moreover, have you e ever met my sister? My daughter once brought her home on a holiday. She was with a girl who had good looks and brown ponytails. Brown ponytails? The Kane, maybe? Your sister, um, your sister seems to be close to her classmates. Also so polite and bright, just looking at them. Brings harmony between friends. Does it look like that when other people see it? It's not in my case at all. Looking at Mr. Ryotaro reminds me of the days your sister would come to play. I miss that little bit. Aw. Silly sister. Don't leave a trace in a useless place. I'm starting to miss her too. <laughs> Why did that rhyme? Trace in a useless place. In the face. Okay. F you. Wag the smell. How many freaking cigarettes do you have? And just like 10 packs or something. Auntie, stop smoking. It smells all over the place. <laughs> what? Why do I have to have j obey a brat's words? If you if you don't like the smell, go somewhere else. Somewhere else? Isn't this place full of monokumas? Just be patient. Even if you don't smell cigarettes. This place is ruined, so it already smells bad, doesn't it? I'm doing you a favor. <laughs> Worship me. It's better to smell the ruins than to smell cigarettes. At least the smell of ruins doesn't make your health worse. Yeah, I was like, secondhand smoke is a thing. Just like when we first met, how can you back talk to me so much? I'll have to talk to your parents, and if I find out, and find out, and find you to get some proper home education. Oh my god, it's all about home education with you, Jesus. At least my mother is more open-minded than Auntie, aren't you? This brat is really... If I ever get out of here, you won't leave me alone. Who do you think you are? I don't think I can get close with this lady, even if I wanted to. She's really the worst. <laughs> no, she's the best girl. You just don't get her like I do. Oh, gosh. <laughs> oh, wait, where are we going again? We were going to the... Where are we going? I don't even fucking remember where we're going, honestly. We're going upstairs. Was that it? Which way did we come from? I don't even fucking remember. I think we came from this way. Okay, guys. Are y'all gonna judge me if I strategically die? Because <laughs> your girl really be thinking about it. She really be thinking about strategically die. Oh, fuck! <laughs> I just wanna see what happened. I mean, it's just, you know, it's just a thought. It's just a thought to strategically play. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh no, that's so crazy, I died again. I was like, I really don't wanna do this again though. It's like, man, I already tried this and I already failed. So it's like, is anybody gonna... <laughs> okay, I see one person saying it's okay. So we're just gonna go for it. <laughs> that's good. Especially since, you know, I did some extra ones earlier to try to... Oh my goodness! No, this is so sad. Oh wow, it actually worked that time. Woo! Like <laughs> I do like doing it with G. Oh, there it is. Hell yeah! Oh, that was so much easier. <laughs> yeah, like do I care? Do I look like I care? I'm gonna cheat. Yeah. Oh fuck me. <laughs> Do I really have to do this again? That's fucking crazy. <laughs> That's fucking crazy, dude. I would go insane if they did not have this stupid little crystal thing. Oh no, that's so crazy. Oh my god, wow. 
I can't believe I'm dying so much. What? Oh my god, there's a Monokume here? Whoa. <laughs> this is so wild. It's so wild. I don't even see him there. It was crazy. It's so crazy. <laughs> oh man. I kind of wish the crystal could just stay out though. It's like, do I look like. Do I look like a gamer to you? <laughs> just a basic speed run, basically. Oh, hell yeah. Oh no, the crystal's back. I guess we'll have to skip it. <laughs> oh, thanks for coming, Monica T. I appreciate it. Hope you have a good night. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 fuck me. No, 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 fuck me. I hate you, Monokuma. I hate... It really be like that, huh? It really be like that, huh? Ah, uh, they should make a story mode. That'd be so nice. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, whatever. Just kill me, Monokuma. Slay me. Slay me. <laughs> oh wait, what the fuck? <gasps> Um. Uh, we're okay, right? We're okay, right? Okay, we're okay, right? Can I load that? Can I load it? Oh shit! Oh my god! Um. Fuck! Wait, can I load it? How do I? Oh god! Um, accidentally pressed some stuff because there was some Korean words. How do I load it though? <laughs> can I, if I skip through this, can I load it? Will that help? Okay, I don't know if that'll work or not. Let me see. Yeah, I guess I have to go back to Omic mode. Oh god, that was so scary. Oof. Oof. Um, I guess maybe I have to go to the main menu? Do I have to go to the main menu, or do I go to the Omic mode? Um, we be as all right now. <laughs> um, because I thought it said something about, let me just like, save one more time down here or something. Just in case, because I feel like there was something about like, you have to save an Omic mode to I don't know. To load Omake Mo? I don't fucking know. It was something weird. I think it was six, right? Okay. I think I... Um, wait. Which file was it? Was it not this one? Okay, it wasn't this one. <laughs> uh, gosh. Okay. Maybe it was seven then? Return. Okay. Maybe it was seven. Ah, uh, I have to keep going back. It's frustrating. Do you guys remember which one it was? Not six. Was it seven? Why do I have so many of these? Maybe it was seven. I guess we'll try seven. Okay, yeah, I think it was this one, right? Oh, man. Time to die. It's your turn to die. Oh, wow. <laughs> it's kind of funny when I actually make it. <laughs> oh, no. Okay. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Bro, he chased me. Okay. Oh, whoa, what the? What the heck? What? 
Ah, oh, is it because I- Oh my god, that's so annoying. <laughs> I gotta say, not a big fan. Not a big fan of the gameplay in this one. <laughs> not a big fan- Oh, fuck. Okay, the crystal's there. Okay. <laughs> I didn't realize if I died in the other area, then I, uh... Oh my gosh. One day we'll beat this game. <laughs> one day. Okay, make sure I die in here. Not in the other room. Not in the other room. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's like walking up to Monokuma. Do your thing, Monokuma. Just kill me. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, there's, is there still more I have to do after this? I don't want to dodge any more Monokumas, dude. I just want to get to the story. Oh, my God. Okay, come on. Okay. Okay, now I gotta be really careful with this. I did not realize that it was gonna do that to me. At least it doesn't seem too bad. Oh, uh, there's like a switch at one point that I have to do. It's like there's a small window, maybe. Ah, fuck! I don't know if there's like two different ones. I can't save here, unfortunately. Man, I don't know if there's just like two. I don't know what it is. It seems like there might be like two different animations, maybe? Was that why I died? Oh, gosh. Man, I hate this. I hate it so much. Just kill me, Monokuma. I want to die. No. He's saying no, and I'm saying yes. Just watch the rest on YouTube. I'm thinking about it, homie. <laughs> I'm really thinking about it. Oh, gosh. Uh, if it wasn't for this part, man. Makes me feel better at the least some other people said that they did that. It's just like, okay, he looks there and then it's like sometimes he moves and then I feel like other times he like doesn't. Yeah, cause sometimes they like both look at the same time. So it's like, do I, how, do I wait? I have to count the rounds of when he's like, when they both look or when like one of them looks like, oh my gosh. I wanna see if anybody speed run, sped run this. <sighs> okay, I think, I'll try it one more time. If I die, I might just watch the rest. <laughs> I might just watch the rest on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, I can't. I can't with this game. Okay. That's when they double it. So he looks to the side. And then... Mm, okay. Looks to the side. Okay. So I have to do that, I think. Then they both... Okay. I think I might have this now. I don't fucking know. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, maybe just go ahead and uh <laughs> go when there's a double. You mean like I mean like I know when it's like when they're like not looking. It's just like trying to time it, because like sometimes they both look and sometimes they don't. You go up the top left, it's not looking. 
Yeah, if you want to go ahead and send that mod, <laughs> I would appreciate it. <laughs> I just don't know if I have the patience for this. Never hesitate is what this mode is. Yeah, I was like... You know, one more time, I was like, hey, giving up. But at the same time, it's like, I just don't know if I could really... I don't know how much lore I have of this and like, just don't, just don't, just don't know if I can handle this much longer. It's like, I know I'm supposed to go when they're both looking that way, but it's like, I just don't know how to time it to when they're both looking that way. It's Midori's fault somehow. Somehow it is. It's like, is there three animation or three cycles that they go through? Okay, both looking. You get to the middle in between them somehow. Or maybe when he's looking to the side. Then I gotta pass that one still. Oh man, the true purpose is to make you feel despair. That's. It's working, man. It's fucking working so hard right now. <laughs> I don't know if I should just wait until they both turn to the side. I mean, it can't be that easy, right? There's no way it's that easy. And they don't even turn to the side that long. Well, they do for like a second there before they both look. Maybe. Okay, I'm gonna try one more time. Is that it? Okay, that's it. I don't know if that's really long enough or not. Gameplay is pure hell. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty bad. <laughs> it's pretty bad. Okay. Any moment now, I'll try, guys. <laughs> Any moment now. <laughs> okay, I think maybe the next one. <sighs> oh my god, there's still more. <laughs> there's still more. <laughs> Uh, I just hate giving up. <laughs> but I also hate this gameplay so much. <laughs> oh god. Okay, so when they do that, I think I can probably run for it, right? Especially if I die here, I will definitely... Oh god. <gasps> <sighs> <sighs> Okay. There's still more. <laughs> I don't know. I might just... <laughs> I might just watch it on YouTube. <laughs> I did it. But yeah. It might be annoying for you guys to watch too, so I'll just find the... Uh... <laughs> I might just uh, find it. I wish I could save, I guess is the only thing. I guess I could see if um I guess I could always just try to die and do it. I'm sure it's not fun for you guys to watch. Just like why I get so nervous with streams, you know? It's like I want to be entertaining. Oh wait, is the crystal down there? You gotta be fucking kidding me. <laughs> it <laughs> I'm pretty sure I already died five times. And uh the crystal's down there. Poggers. <laughs> so great. <laughs> That's so great. So awesome. Love that. <laughs> so hypothetically, if I go down there and get the crystal, is it gonna teleport me past this part? Yeah, I think I'm... <laughs> I think I'm good. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, <laughs> thank you, Monkey. <laughs> thank you, Monkey. Yeah, I don't know if this crystal... Yeah, I think, uh, I think I'm good. I think, I feel bad, but I think I might be good. Vodka juice in, you send it, so 
I was like, if it would have gone to a cutscene, you know, I might have been like, hey, let's just go ahead and uh, play it out. But like, I just don't think I can do this. I don't think I have the patience. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, man. Yeah, let's just go ahead and exit out. <laughs> Okay, um, cool, cool. What part am I at? Do you know, Monkey? Um, let's see. I guess I'll just kind of. Oh, seeing the timestamp after. Okay, sweet. Thank you. Oh, two eight of three. Awesome. Thank you so much. Let me make sure the audio. You guys hear okay? <laughs> this girl, I love this girl who's slaying. Um, okay, I think that gets it kind of centered, right? Okay, it's 2.08. Oh, man. I guess we can just skip this part. Skip the, uh... I guess I can always just kind of, like, speed it through, like, uh, when it's doing, like, the gameplay stuff. Oh, night, Eli, thanks for coming! Um, ag. The floor laying the stairs has collapsed. I thought it was fine when I took Auntie back. Then we can't go upstairs! Look at this, that's why I told you to chase after them earlier. I knew it was going to be like this. What are we gonna do now, kid? This is all your fault somehow. Ugh. Wait, Ryotaro, isn't there a room you didn't enter on the road you passed earlier? Maybe there's something there? Um, that's where there were a lot of Monokumas when I brought her back. I didn't want to go inside because it looked dangerous. But we can't go upstairs anymore, so maybe it would be best to not hesitate here. I think we should try. No, look. <laughs> oh god, I'm keeping the voices confused. Yeah, thank you, Zeph, for doing this. <laughs> oh gosh. Shout out to Zeph for <laughs> doing this. Um, uh, crap. <laughs> it's like. <laughs> so, no, look here. Why did Case Scan and Ando keep throwing away our necks? In this moment, let's just wait for a rescue. We don't have any clocks here, so we don't know how long it has been since we were kidnapped. If the rescue comes, it would have arrived way sooner. And the purpose isn't just to escape, but for our daughters, too. We also need to find the whereabouts of our families. Have you forgotten? Okay, then. Don't leave yet. The room on the way. Let's head to the room where there were a lot of Monokumas. I'm so glad I don't have to do this, dude. <laughs> oh my god, just watching it, dude. I'm like, oh my god, I'd have to do this shit again? <laughs> Hell no. Bless you, Zeph. I'm gonna speed through this. Okay. Do 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 do. Three times speed. Do 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 do. Okay, here we go. The ballroom. Uh, let me slow down again. Yes, bless you, Zeph. I'm so grateful for the translation and for playing through this gameplay, dude. Wait, what's this? It's a very long hallway. Wait. Oh, look over there. Yay, the ballroom. Oh, that chapter was so good. The wall collapsed, creating a foothold. So there's a door on top of it. Oh, neat. We get to go in there. Actually go up to the next floor. That's wonderful. If we're going this way... Let me slow it down. That's wonderful. If we go this way, it might lead to the fifth floor. But there is one thing to deal with. What is it, KSK bro? After coming here, doesn't it feel like everything is staged? Oh yeah, I can see what he means. A series of landscapes decorated as if somebody was handling this ordeal. Making it just oh so perfect to get there. Because to me, it feels kind of like that. I thought I thought that was a little strange too, but unless there's another way, it can't be helped. Right? You're right. If we're going, then move fast. That criminal upstairs will run away. 
It all feels like an act. If the Is the culprit's purpose something else? Did they change their minds to keep us alive? Okay, let's... Oh. <laughs> that was just like, fuck it. <laughs> oh god, that's great. <laughs> I feel that though. <laughs> Who cares if they see you just go fast enough to, uh, <laughs> to escape it. This place seems to be in relatively good condition compared to the other places, doesn't it? Is this place up in the fifth floor? I think it's probably because the atmosphere has changed strangely. Still, I think we better be careful. I have a terrifying feeling about this place. The culprit who kidnapped us is here. I hope there are clues about my brother and the others here. Like it or not, this feels like... It feels like the climax is approaching. The climax of the Monokuma dodging! I'm so glad I don't have to play that. We need to be careful more than ever. Let's go ahead and skip through this. Wait, this is the fifth floor? Let me go back to normal speed. Okay, this shit is worse than I thought. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess this is the first time they're seeing the fifth floor with all the blood and stuff. Blood? All of this is blood? No surprise here, right? If you walk around a bit, you'll see blood and corpses by now. Yeah. No, this blood. Looks like it was dried out a while ago. At least it's not a blood stain of recent years. Who the hell is doing such a mess like this? By the way, Ryotaro bro, once said that this place is like Hope's Peak Academy. What? This is Hope's Peak Academy? That's a one wild ass guess. I just took a look at places that look like classrooms or the infirmary and like the, literally the signs of our dead family members on the dorms. So I just thought it might be the case. But looking at this place, that impression was wrong. I don't know what happened. I don't know what happened, but aside from clues, I think we can get out from this place. Is there something on this floor? I can feel a slight breeze coming from here. I think there is an exit somewhere on this floor. Yay! What is that true, Keisuke? Do you guys think they're gonna live? I don't know. I feel like hopefully they will, but I feel like <laughs> I don't know. Looking at like the how many survivors there were in the main game, I'm kind of uh, unsure. We can finally get out of here. Hold on, we haven't found a single clue about our families. We can't just leave yet. What are you saying? If we get a chance to get out, we should get out. Do you want to die in a place like this? Either way, even if we find a clue, it's important to secure an exit first. For now, let's keep moving. Yeah, she's not exactly the, um, <laughs> the uh, mom of the year, right? <laughs> like, <laughs> fuck my daughter. I just want to leave. Is there really an exit on this floor? Can we escape safely? I came here to find clues about my sister, but I haven't found any yet. Do we really go all the way to this place to capture us without any meaning? Did they really go all the way to this place to capture us with any mini? Okay, that's kind of nice. Put in the translations too. Then what's the culprit's purpose? Okay. Skip through this part. God bless you, Zephyrum, for doing this part. I could not be so strong to do this. <laughs> oh, gosh. How painful was this, Zeph, on a scale of 1 to 10? <laughs> this looks so... <laughs> this looks pretty bad. Okay, pant, pant. Just a second. Let me take a breather. Can I... Nah, she might not be doing good again. Well, it seems like we sprinted too much. Isn't it strange that Monokuma security became even more severe? Certainly. I felt it more vaguely on the fourth floor. Who cares? It's still hard. I'm not the type to run around like this. If there is a sus suspicious person in this floor that Ryotaro mentioned, and that person is the one controlling Monokuma, then the reason for that can be explained. Yes, but there is no confirmation, so let's start with a little break and continue again. The other side of the hallway seems to be the last room. Here we go, get into the end game. 
I glanced at the other side of the hallway for a while, and there was no stairs from this floor to climb up. In other words, this floor is the last one. Kisuke said there was an exit somewhere on this floor, and there is no place to go up anymore. I wonder if our short journey is about to end. Ah! Huh? Midori, what's wrong? This guy! The person in this photo! Is it Kizaragi? Oh yeah, best boy! <laughs> Love you, Kizaragi! I miss you! I miss you so much! This person? Who is this guy? I've seen this guy! It was a picture that my brother showed me! It was taken at the school! Aw, oh, I miss Kizaragi. Midori, Midori, what'd you say? Your brother showed you this picture? Yeah, I saw that photo one day. Blue hair and purple eyes, it's unique, and I remember well. Isn't that Mr. Kizaragi? Kizaragi, who's that? I heard he was a classmate from my daughter. When the medical equipment we use at our hospital broke down, Kanata introduced me to a friend of hers who could fix it. Kizaragi, best boy, always coming in. Always coming in clutch. At that time, it was a medical device that was discontinued and can no longer be obtained. But even so, Mr. Kizaragi, who came at the time, created it in just a few days. Created it? Medical devices? Yeah, he was the ultimate inventor. He said that making any kind of thing was his specialty, besides the uh, memory wipe thing. I guess he was rushed, but there was some really uh, bad, uh, <laughs> really bad um, side effects for that one, dude. Making metal devices on the fly seems to be beyond level of skills. Hold on, so you're saying that this person was also a student at Hope Speak Academy? And he was also a classmate of Ando's daughter? Not only that, the only thing I learned through my daughter about Ryotaro's sister, Midori's brother, and Minako is that he said he knew all of them before. Beyond simply being a student at Hope Speak Academy, they were friends in the same class. Then the people gathered here are families of Hope Speak 79th class only? Seems like it. 79th class. My sister's classroom at Hope's Peak. Getting closer to the truth. No other person, only the family of the 79th class members were gathered. That can't be a coincidence. By the way, the fact that Kizaragi's picture is hanging here means that... This is Hope's Peak Academy? Yeah, starting to figure it out. I don't know, but our families we're looking for are all in the same class. It seems clear to me that there's something they were involved in that other students did not. Yippers. In the end, the real truth will be until we find the culprit. The truth we don't know? I wonder who the culprit is. I feel like it might be another sibling, maybe? I'm like, I don't think it would make sense if it was Yuki's mom. <laughs> but, you know, <laughs> that'd be kind of that'd be kind of weird. But I'm like, I don't really have any suspects. The real truth. Oh, besides Bitch, of course, the 17th student hiding in the school. The real truth. We haven't seen it yet, but I feel like I've become more certain with the current clue. On this last floor, something will definitely happen. Oh no. Um, hey, is this chatter gonna take any longer? I wanna get out of this horrible place. I thought she was doing something sussy for a second. As soon as possible. Auntie, you're not being helpful either. I don't give a shit about that guy. Come on. Okay. Back to some more wonderful gameplay. <laughs> oh, God bless you, Zeph. I gotta like this video. I wish I could... I'm gonna go into my second account just to like this video again for your sake, Zeph. <laughs> oh, my God. Look at those fucking Monokumas. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> Little dancey dance just like the Monokumas. Oh, gosh. Oh, I should have known. Of course, it's just Gray Man. Oh, yeah, I think the next person will be someone related to Michi, Yama, Kenji, or Haru. Yeah, it's like, would the Mastermind be somebody, um, like, else? I don't know, like, related to somebody else? I'm not really sure yet. I guess we'll see. Phew, it seems that we somehow made it to the end of this hallway. Thank God. Is the exit still not found? I can't run anymore. Hold it. Heisuke, where are you going? Because it can't be yes, because I think they would have recognized the voice. There's... Come this way! Uh, 
This is... The wind is blowing from here? Yeah, it looks like this is the exit. Yay, slay! <laughs> yes, thank God. We're alive. I live. Let's get out of here. Wait a moment. It's good that we found an exit, but we haven't found any clues about the whereabouts of our families yet, right? That's right. If we work so hard and don't achieve even this part of our goals, we'll regret it. Let's go back and go around those Monokumas, guys. Everybody's favorite thing. Um, even if it was a lie that my sister was alive, I won't go back until I find evidence that, that it really was a lie. You guys, are you still thinking about that? They're all fucking dead. Use common sense. We walked around this large place like a mouse, but there was no single clue. And there's blood on the walls. Come on now. They kidnapped us as their families like bait. We can't do anything but feel regret. I see no reason to be here any longer. I mean, like, it is messed up, you know, that she's saying this. But she is right, <laughs> actually. They are all dead. But for some reason, I still feel like we can't leave yet. I... So do I. It may just be a feeling, but I think my brother's clues are still here. Uh, I hope they don't find the lab with all the dead bodies. That would suck. That would be the most, like, traumatic thing, I think, to happen. That would be really bad. Oh, thank you, Turia. Mastermind, Modkey, and Monima. <laughs> Monima. <laughs> Mastermind, Modkey, and Monica. Believe me, Weeby. Believe me. That is so true, Turia. We... We love a couple that slays. <laughs> Thanks for the donation, by the way. Uh-huh. Miss Tamori, since we've come this far and found an exit, there will be no threat to our lives anymore. Have you fucking seen those Monokubas? Just a little longer. Why don't we try to find our families? At least as far as we can. Ah, cough, cough! Oh, yeah. They also got her to worry about. Midori, are you okay? I'm fine. The part where my stomach was stuttered earlier is a little... Cough, cough. Miss Yamaguchi, would you mind looking at your condition for a minute? Yeah, it is suck, but it might be good if they leave just for her sake. This is... You're injured! Miss Yamaguchi, why didn't you tell me sooner? I oh, didn't want to be a burden. I'm sorry, I was afraid you all would be delayed because of me. Midori, you idiot, you said we shouldn't! What should we do, Mr. Ando? Can you do first aid again? No, this is worse than before. In the beginning, it was no different than a liver operation, and the wound is still... <laughs> no. <laughs> no different than a simple liver operation. <laughs> and the wound is still open. As the wind seeps over the dust of the ruins... Uh, gonna get infected. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, cough. Hey, we can't do this. We're in an elementary, an emergency situation for Midori, so she has no choice but to go to the exit and ditch all our kids. <laughs> Slay! Stop joking, Auntie, as if we're going to leave her alone. It can't be helped. If I remember the exit, I might be able to go out and come back. So I'm going to treat Midori first, and then come back, Mr. Ando. Okay, you're gonna treat Midori? I agree, there's a patient in front of me, and I have no intention of acting selfishly. Hey, let's just leave her. <laughs> <laughs> By putting my needs as first. It's okay, Case Gabriel and Mr. Ando. I'm totally fine, so don't worry about me and look for clues from your family. Poor girl. Stop lying. I can already see the blood leaking from the very bottom of your clothes. I... Fine, fine. We shouldn't do this, Midori. Your body. You should think of it first. Come on. Let's escape. I was like... Don't worry, Miss Yamaguchi. It's never too late to come to come back after treatment. Let's carry your body first. I'm sorry, everyone. Yeah. It's like, sad, but it's for the best. Well, now, it makes me a little sad if you get out like this. Here we go, mastermind time. It'd be kind of dope if it was Utsuro again, but probably not. Probably not. Gray man, reveal yourself. Who is it? That voice. Watch out! Ah! Oh, fuck. <laughs> That's not good. Whoa, what? Suddenly flames? Oh, no, 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 the exit's blocked! Damn it! It's like, she took too long on the cancer patient! <laughs> not this one. Enter the room right across from you. Uh. Oh, I guess that one. What? Who's talking right now? 
It's the culprit. That's right, that's him. It's the voice I heard when I took Auntie to Mori. Perhaps he doesn't want us to escape. And that's why I told you, we should have escaped immediately. What are we going to do now? If it's the opposite room, it must be the hole right in front of us. Oopsie. <laughs> KSK bro, are you going? We have no choice but to go. The exit is blocked and he's calling us. The purpose is still the same because looking for the culprit is looking for clues about our family. Yeah, makes sense. The purpose is still the- yeah. And we have to treat Miss ya Yamaguchi as soon as possible. It's like, maybe some people could, you know, go go after them while he treats her. I guess there's- uh, the fire is a pretty big emergency, so not too much to do. Mitch. <laughs> That's what everybody's saying in chat. It's Mitch! Oh my god! It's Bitch, the 17th student. He's finally making his appearance. I don't know what's going to happen when we meet them. So all I can do is a simple m disinfection. Please! Hey, why is everyone going to see this dangerous person? Please don't, we're going to die. It's your own decision. If Auntie wants to keep complaining, but there's nothing we can do about this. If you're scared, then stay here, Auntie. Who says I'm scared? I'll go too. And maybe that guy might know what happened to my daughter, All right? Not that I even care. I feel a bit conflicted about Kasuna's well-being. A little bit. I can't help it now. I might love her a little bit. The exit is blocked. Your tension really goes up and down, Miss Mori. I really don't want to go. Please protect me and Midori with your ideal powers, boys. <laughs> protect me, boys. A mysterious figure who summoned us by himself. Approaching them may be dangerous, but only they know the secret of our situation. Our journey, which seemed long, long but short, is now going to go through one last step. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, start fast forwarding. Oh, JK. <laughs> there wasn't really much to fast forward through. <laughs> My bad. Ugh. Oh, whoa. Hey, Yuki's there. What the? <laughs> It just looks like that. Oh my god, it was just Gray Man the whole time. <laughs> I thought they just had him look like a Gray Man to not spoil it, but I guess it really is Gray Man. Damn it. Gray Man has been setting up every culprit in every chapter of every Danganronpa game this whole time. This whole freaking time. Oh yeah, NBA highlights. I gave up. <laughs> I gave up. There was it was too much, dude. Too too much. Oh gosh. I like that he's just a gray man. <laughs> a doll standing casually in a raging flame because of the fire. I cannot see their figure properly. And then, like, Yuki's just, like, casually on the ground. Or Utsuro, I guess, now? We'll see. Mishcore. <laughs> Are they controlling the doll? A single glance, I could tell. I can fix gray man. It was not an ordinary person. It was gray man. Damn you, gray man. I should have known Mitch would never kill anybody. He would never hurt a single fly. It was Gray Man that set him up. This is so sad. Are you the identity of the voice? Of the voice? <laughs> da, 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 da. Yes, if you get out like this, things will get difficult. Okay, Gray Man. D Gray Man. Things will get Difficult? You're the one who dragged us to this place, you freaking weirdo! Indeed, I'm the one who sent you the letter. The third Kizaragi Research Lab is the location of the culprit who kidnapped you, written in the letter. That's cool, bro. Third Kizaragi Lab? Wasn't this a school? Or something? Wait a minute, what about st the students and everyone? You must have murdered! There's no murderers, but for now... Let me tell you, the kids are alive. Don't worry. Oh. What? <laughs> Bro, you just fucking capping. <laughs> what? You're just lying your ass off right now. The kids are alive, yeah. They're very much alive. <laughs> Don't worry. Don't worry. Inori was not electrocuted to death by a preacher. That did not happen. <laughs> Our purpose itself is not to kill. He was talking about the students, right? Like, they're definitely dead. This is after the game. Purpose. Since you didn't attack us right away, it looks like they're planning to have a conversation. 
All right. Didn't you kidnap up us for some reason just to lie to you fools? Then my brother, is it true our family is alive? <laughs> Hell no, I was just fucking with you guys. Yes, I kidnapped you for a purpose. And I know everything about your families. But why do I have to tell you about them? All of you will die soon. Anyways, I kind of thought maybe that was the reason why he was um lying. Because I was like, if he's just going to kill them anyways, then maybe he's like, eh, whatever, you know? What? Ah! Lulu! Found you, bitches! Kia! What's this? Let me go! Let me go! There's only one way. From now on, all of you must kill each other. Ah, what the? <laughs> a killing game, you might say! What, what did you? I am also a Junko Kenny. You're telling us to kill each other? What kind of nonsense are you saying? It's kind of our thing that we do. If you only wanted to kill us, you could have killed us sooner. But I want to watch you guys kill each other after becoming besties. No, it becomes troublesome if it's not now. What is up with this guy? No, if you're having a hard time doing it. The Monokumas will help you in this regard. Didn't we? I think we did say that bitch was like canonically. Well, <laughs> as canonically as Mitch's fake brother that we made up can be. I think he actually did canonically canonically doesn't he have red eyes didn't we decide that because i'm pretty sure his sprite edit has red eyes so this is a bitch they haven't even said his name yet so i'm convinced that this is a bitch slay bitch slay <laughs> Look how it's literally just like slay bitch that's also his name stop it uh, i don't want to die originally i don't have any grudges against you guys it's unavoidable don't think badly of it. You guys are good. <laughs> you guys are good. You guys are all good now. A good offering for Master Utsuro. Is he gonna eat us? The fuck? <laughs> Am I going to die so suddenly? Aw, Maki. Without knowing anything about my sister? Without knowing anything about the others' families? I miss you, Maki. Use her better. At least we have mod key. <laughs> I came here to check on my sister's life or death. But I didn't know anything about her. And instead of that, I let her go alone. Midori, Keisuke, Uncle Ando, Aunt Tamori. Sister. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit, bro! Oh, hell yeah! <gasps> Queen! Queen Ray! Yes! Slay! Yes! Slay Ray! Oh my god, I'm so happy to see you! You look good, too, girl! Hell yeah! Hell yeah! That's enough, you! Oh my god, what a fucking girl boss! Huh? Oh, hell yeah! Who? Seriously, screw you, Kinjo. Leaving the troublesome work to me. <laughs> Hell yeah. This is amazing. What a fucking girl boss. Are you able to move on your own, Ray Makaru? Makaru? Oh yeah, I like the song too. Oh yes, I'm very... I'm so very angry status right now, you know. I'm going to clean up and go back. Wait a moment. You are- Who are you? Why did you save us? You are Mr. Ando. The greetings were late. But now, please wait for a while. Including the others. I have to deal with this guy first. Ah, oh, she looks so good. Shoot. Yeah, shoot him. Or are you fine with this? Even if you shoot me. Yuki Maida. As long as you've arrived, this plan ended up in a complete failure. But it's okay. As long as I have Yuki Maida, I can make my plans again at any time. Huh. Give Maida back! They're trying to, like, revive Maida or something? Uh, holy shit! No, you took him. They disappeared on the flames! Hello, Teruya! Radar! Ah, Teruya's here too! What? No response? Damn it, I just caught them all! He kind of seemed, like, passed out. I was like, is Utsuro not, um, revealed anymore? In front of my nose. Hey. 
Yes, I know, I'm sort... I'll sort things out. Wait up. Yay! It's kind of sad they have to find out that everybody they love died. Your family is here. This is what you were hoping to hear, right? <laughs> They're all fucking dead. <laughs> and also, your daughter is a bitch, Tamori. <laughs> oh my god, I was especially glad when she died. And I called her a bitch and everything. Oh, it's great. I'll explain step by step, so please calm down and listen. Kind of seems like Yuki's okay. Can I be Delulu and say that Akane is okay too? I mean, like, it was just a flesh wound. She's probably alive. You're doing good, right? You're doing good, right, Akane? After a while, we heard many stories from the woman who saved us. The fact that she was my sister's classmate, the fact that she was the ultimate professor, Rei Makaru, in the 79th class of Hope's Peak, and the survivors of the 79th generation formed an organization called Kizaragi Agency to eliminate the remnants of despair. Yeah, that were spread across the world and to maintain security at the same time. Oh, thank you, gamer bro. <laughs> Wavy, I think you need to stop telling people to slay. We don't know. We don't need what happened to the Discord killing game to happen again. Oh, yeah, <laughs> that was pretty rough. <laughs> we, did a, we did a Discord, uh, like, Wheel of Fate killing game, and, like, every person that I made, like, my uh, bestie in the game, like, would just end up becoming the culprit in the very next chapter. It was pretty funny. <laughs> Thanks for the donation. I appreciate it. It was very confusing, but we still listened to everything. And the most surprising thing is that my older sister and her classmate, Miss Makaru, who was recorded as dead, was still alive. It's like, oh yay, maybe Maki's still alive too. Nope, she's dead. I'm very sad that all of your relatives are dead, except for Kazuna. <laughs> That's not how it happened anyways. Maybe he just wanted you guys to play a killing game. They sure do love their killing games in order to achieve something similar as we did, but we're still investigating the details. I can't believe it was Gray Man the whole time. Right, besides the fact that this is a laboratory that was buried in the area and disappeared. I guess it's just like the blue people, but like the evil version. Was reproduced on a similar island as is. The ability of criminals should never be underestimated. And the reason why this place is so ruined is because the Kizaragi Laboratory used tactical weapons, right? I'm sorry, originally the families of our classmates were believed to be all on this floor and were aiming for the basement, but it seems that one of our idiots <laughs> did the wrong investigation. <laughs> nice. Anyways, except for us- She's <laughs> talking about Teruya. <laughs> These freaking Jun Junko candies. So true, bestie. Uh, oh yeah, the Discord killing game. It might have been while you were asleep. Uh, I'm not totally sure. We'll probably do another one at some point. Anyways, except for us, everyone else in the family has already been rescued. It was kind of like a spur of the moment thing. Besides the families who were cut off here, your family's outside or your family members. In other places, they're all being protected by the agency. <laughs> Except for the people you came looking for. Except for some idiots who join the side of despair. Still, Makaru, somehow your impression is very different from what I heard from my sister. I heard the name Makaru a while ago and just thought about... Because my sister told me once... What? Kiyokamaki? Oh my god. <laughs> I cannot stop saying it, dude. <laughs> Kiyokamaki? What did you hear? <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I literally think I've said Maki more than Maki, because Maki died so early, you know? I heard that she was completely, I heard that she was completely unlucky, arrogant, overbearing, and can't even, and is not easy to play with. <laughs> oh, man. She was kind of telling the truth, though. Because she's a beauty and has a completely different level of intelligence. Oh, she said I was beautiful, huh? Kyoka, is that how that woman described me as? <laughs> Sigh. Hey, how long are you going to be like this? It's all sorted out, so let's go back quickly. Let's do that. She said that all our families are being protected. <laughs> I don't think she's told them yet about the ones that aren't being protected. Besides, the fact that Miss Mata the besides the fact that Miss Makari was alive like this means that Sati and her other family are members are also safe too, right? I don't know why my brother hasn't con connected me, but what was written in the letter was true. Nah. Yeah, my sister's a... Girl, you gotta tell them soon, girl. She's like, mm -hmm. <sighs> about that. 
Uh, you guys have something really interesting to discuss with Teruya once we get back to base. <laughs> I'm gonna let him handle that. Uh, thank you, Professor Birch, for becoming an Omelander. I appreciate that. The 79th class students who thought who we thought were dead, like Makaru, worked together to fight the remnants of despair. Oh, God. This is gonna be so painful. Oh, God. Hmm. What's wrong, Miss Makaru? I have a lot to tell you when we go back to the agency. Oh, God. When you're ready to move, talk to me. Miss Makaru had a face full of sadness for a single moment. <laughs> Ray, tell them, Teruya! <laughs> that is, she is very good at doing that. She's like, Yuki's not here anymore. Tell them, Teruya! Doesn't matter anyways, I managed to escape without anyone dying, and I even confirmed that my whole family was safe. Especially Maki. <laughs> She's extra safe in Mexico. <laughs> she ends up telling them, she's like, yes, they're all in um Mexico. Oh my god, that's awesome. When can we see them? They're very busy in Mexico, so um, you know, uh you I don't think you'll ever be able to see them again, but don't worry, they're alive and safe. Just be Lulu like we be. This is the best ending for reals. <laughs> god. <laughs> oh gosh. We came here to save you. This is a terrible place. All the Monokumas outside have been cleaned up. Rest assured. The Kizaragi agency will protect you. Don't fool around with Miss Makaru. <laughs> Wasn't planning on it, dude, but thank you. I'm scared, distraught. Someone please save me whenever I go. Whatever, well, wherever I close my eyes. Still, why am I attracted to this? Is this fear? Is this a Kane? I don't understand who this is. Am I strange for being attracted to fear? I, who am I? They seem to like despair. Or is that Yuki? When he was getting turned into Yuki? Are you ready? Talk to Mikaru, there's something left. Okay, you'll need some time to catch your breath. Tell me when you're ready. Okay. Talk to Mikaru. All your friends are dead. <laughs> That's basically it. Ms. Makaru, thank you for saving me. If it wasn't... Uh, let me slow it down again. If it wasn't for you, we'd all be dead by now. It's our fault for not coming sooner. Don't worry about it. The rest of you are, are our classmates' families. It's only natural to save them. Still, it seems Makaru knows all of us. It's my job to investigate, Mr. Keisuke Iranami. Even my name... In addition for rescuing you, I have a favor to ask from the Kizaragi Agency. I shall not force you, but I'd like you to lend me your strength. Yeah, fight against despair. Strength from us? Do we have that power? Compared compared to the ultimate, swear. The title of ultimate level is nothing more than talent. Oh, hey. Kind of change in her tune a little bit, because she was like so big about talent, too. Not everyone is competent just because they have talent. Don't speak like that. Midori Yamaguchi. Yes, even Mr. Ando. Oh, oopsie, my alarm. Yes, even Mr. Ando can become our strength. There are a lot of things I want to ask others, too. You said you'll protect us, but I have but I have to work. Um, isn't that a little bit much? <laughs> I don't really feel like doing that. Mr. Monaco is the other way around, since we're in a protection status. Isn't it polite to give us to give our support? Can you just leave with- can I just leave with Kazuna? Even if it's dangerous outside, living in a big city isn't really an inconvenience for me. I feel like it would be crazy if, like, um, she's been acting so, like, um, like she doesn't care. But I feel like when she finds out that Kazuna's dead, she's gonna be, like, the one who breaks down the hardest. Auntie, you'll make a mess if you keep saying your life is more important than your daughter's. Oh, God. Oh no, are you ready? All right, then let's depart. All the, the result was not completed. Bye Clover, thanks for coming by. And thanks for uh, helping Mod. Still, I'm glad I was able to come here and save all of you. Whatever the outcome, my hope. Because they left behind a symbol of hope. Wait, what was that? Although, I'm glad I was able to come here. The result was not completed, and save all of you. 
Whatever about the outcome, my hope. Whatever the outcome, my hope. Because they left behind a symbol of hope. Oh, I thought maybe she explained more who they was. Yuki? The best worst boy? The worst best boy? <laughs> and so we were able to escape from the hellish laboratory. <clears throat> I get it, it's hard to say, but like, she really does need to tell them, dude. The laboratory was built on a remote island, and Miss Makari's party seemed to have arrived by helicopter. How did they kidnap us from different places to this island? I don't know that mystery. Miss Wakari told many stories, one after another, that we couldn't tell on the way back in the helicopter. The culprit who kidnapped us is said to be from a mysterious group that has been recently caught in the information network of the Kizragi Agency. Yuki Maida, it seemed that they were a special person to Miss Makaru. Ah, she still loves Yuki. <laughs> That's so sad, dude. <laughs> she still wants to. She still wants to save him, I guess. Ugh. I know. I mean, like it's hard for them. Of course, they would still care about Yuki even after like they find out. But uh, it's just so hard. It's like I expected Yuki to be like the mastermind or like connected to it from like the very beginning. But like, ah. Uh, it was like so different seeing it, you know, and seeing how like messed up he was. But it's like, uh, it's so weird. Cause yeah, he was so sweet in the game. It's like, I can understand why they would still be, um, whatchamacallit, like torn. I wonder how Kenjo feels. I know he's gotta be really, really torn up and like, I don't know, conflicted. She mentioned that they were busily working towards a certain purpose for a person named Maida. Ugh, I'm crying. <laughs> but this time they were able to, they were able to catch him by the radar network, and Miss Makaru moved directly. I don't know what's up with Maida right now, or slash Utsuro, because, like, it seemed like he was, um, passed out, you know? However, neither me nor Miss Makaru and the others were able to fully understand their identity or purpose. And Miss Makaru lamented that it might be a more troubling organization than they thought when they came face to face. She also explained about the Future Foundation, which operates for a similar purpose to the Kizaragi Agency. She also explained the current conditions of the world. And she still didn't tell us that our uh, family <laughs> was dead. Oh god. But okay, here we go. But above all else, the story we couldn't help but to... What was it? What do you say? To engrave? Engrave in our ears. The story that Miss Makari took a few deep breaths before bringing it out. Yeah. Oh, God. Aw. It's sad. At least they buried them. Oh, he works for the Kizaragi Agency, too, now. Oh, that's sweet. Oh. Sister, it's been a while. Aw. I heard it. Everything from Miss Makaru. The things that my sister went through. The fact that Higa killed my sister. No, not Mitchy Witchy. No. <laughs> he would never. It was Gray Man. He set him up. The fact that all their bodies were buried. That was really nice of them to bury their bodies. The fact that the only thing we recovered was just a formal grave like this. Strange, isn't it? The news that my older sister was dead. It's quite obvious, I knew. A few years ago, the greatest and most desperate event in human history occurred. News was spread like a big explosion. But why is it still so sad? Aww. To confirm my own sister's death with my own eyes. It was too sad. I know, poor guy, dude. I know he was, like, kind of tsundere, but he's just, like, you know, he's just a kid. He doesn't really know how to express his emotions, right? Sister, I'm currently working at the Kizaragi Agency. Your sister was a badass. I'm not a kid anymore. Of course, I'm a lot more busy. And there are a lot of painful things happening. It's nothing compared to what my sister went through. Not this much. Sister must have tried to instill hope on everyone, even in the midst of confusion. Because that was a specialty of my sister, who was annoying, but gentle as well. I know, she was such a sweetie, dude. <sighs> such a badass, too. Sister, you were doing well, right? Wait for me. Aww. I'll do my best to not let your efforts go to waste. Yeah. 
It's up to me to continue my sister's share. That's sweet, living on for her. Poor Ryotaro. Man. It's pretty sad. I'll fight, despair, to the very end. I did want to see everybody else's reactions, though, too. I guess they might not show that. Chapter 6.5, a missing hope link, a symbol of hope. Yeah, I was like, how did they rema cover the remains from the credits? Because it seemed like they all, you know, went into, like, the water, right? Ugh, finding all of Ayami's pieces. I was thinking about that. That would have to be so, like... I don't even know, dude. Zeph, you only died 32 times? Oh my god, I must have died like 200 times. <laughs> Ultimate gamer right here. <laughs> Ultimate gamer Zeph. Oh my gosh. Oh, thank you, NBA Highlights. Super Dog Rapa, another two is going to be so elite. I can't wait. Me too. Oh, I'm so excited about that. We do still have to play if in the free time events. I'm not sure um, how long that's going to be. I'll probably have to do that next week, honestly. I kind of expected to finish everything up this week, but... Um, Probably finish it up next week. I'm not really sure. I don't know. I was like, man, I really do want to start the second game. But uh, I might, depending on how busy I am next week, I was like, maybe I'll stream uh, the if stuff on Saturday and then do Danganronpa another two on Sunday. Because, like, I really do want to go ahead and get it started. Because I'm so freaking excited for it. <laughs> I'm so excited. But we'll see. Um, we'll see. If it's not, if I'm not starting it next week, it'll definitely be the week after. But, yeah, I was like, I don't think I can play too much more tonight. <laughs> but, um, yeah. Thanks, guys. Um, I can, uh, maybe, uh, oh, if it's, like, one hour long. Okay, it's not too bad then. Because, yeah, I have that. And then I have, like, a decent amount of free time events, um, to do. So, We'll see. We will see. But uh, thanks, guys, for coming to the stream. Um, probably we'll just go ahead and end it here, and then we can finish up some of the other stuff uh, next week. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry if my gameplay was uh, painful to watch. Uh, that was just so hard. I'm glad that at least there's other people that thought it was hard, too. I'm sure, like, other people are better at it than I am, too. I don't really think... Uh, I don't know. I just get, like, stressed out on stream, too, so I like to know overthink things. And it can be pretty tough. But thanks, guys, for coming to the stream. I hope you still enjoyed it. Cringe and all. And watched me, you know, <laughs> losing my mind. <laughs> I did lose my mind a few times. I hope that was uh, entertaining, at least. Thanks, guys, for coming to the stream. I will see you next week. Bye.